Good evening, fellow partygoers. I hope you're having a lovely evening tonight because I am. Therefore, we should all have a wonderful time together. We're playing a lovely little game here called Chicory, a colorful tale. And from what I've been informed, it's got pretty good music. Mostly because one time on a drive home, it popped up on a playlist. And so I was like, oh, that's lovely. Because it's, the, the music was done by apparently uh, one of the same people who did the music for Celeste, which is another lovely game that I played because of the music. Uh, all I know about this was reading the descriptions, the trailers, uh, watching the trailers, reading the descriptions, and apparently there's some artist bunny that goes missing and then all the color of the land just goes with her. And so you, Doggy, your number one fan, picks up the paintbrush and I guess continues on from there. I don't really know what I'm getting myself into, so uh, might as well jump right in. Apparently there's a co-op mode too. Didn't know about that before I popped in here. What's your favorite food? I'm not sure, confirm, or write it in. My favorite food, I love sushi. Sushi is my favorite food, I think. That or mac and cheese. We should combine the two. Sushi and, okay, sushi and mac. That's what I'm going with. Not necessarily the two together, but I like sushi and I like mac and cheese. So it'd be sushi or mac. And I will go with it. I like that. I'll confirm that. The magic paintbrush. It's every stroke fills our world with color. It's magic and it's a paintbrush. Naturally, someone has to wield it. The brush has been passed down through the ages. To, to the bunny. From the, from the jackalope, maybe? But the current wielder, Chicory. She's so cool! A total genius! Our world's never looked better thanks to her. Is that so? And that's why it's up to me to keep her tower clean. I love how the magic paintbrush is the least colorful thing around. I love that. Oh, so I, I clean things up. Oh, look at this. Ah, okay. This is so pleasant so far. The music is so lovely. I hope this sounds okay. I love the way this sounds. Wow, it's so exciting. So I, I, I clean, I guess, if I go back in. Oh, look at that. I will make things bright again. I will bring color back to this dreary, dreary world by doing so with this and coloring around. I think I like this. I, I first thought to myself that this is like a painting type of game. Should I get out like my drawing tablet and, uh, and use that? Oh, hello. Okie dokie. I guess I'm not cleaning that up anymore. Oh, ellipsy ellipses. Interrobang. Alrighty then. I guess I'll continue cleaning. <laughs> I'll just continue cleaning the rest of the room. This is so happy-go-lucky so far. Music is so nice. and I struggle to... I, I guess it, it makes me want to paint in between the lines, but I don't want to paint in between the lines. Look at this thing over here. I'm happy to not paint in the lines all the time. I don't make things as beautiful as I possibly can by cleaning things up and bringing more color to... I guess there's not a lot of color here. I feel like there could be There could be more. There could be more and more color here. So far, I am absolutely enthralled by all the various color gradients and stuff here. I like that. I like that very much. The world could use more... Tragedy, disaster, ellipses, and interrobangs, apparently. <laughs> Whoops, guess I bumped something again. <laughs> Me a little doggy fella. Is my name Sushi and Mac? Is is that why? Usually you pick your name in the beginning of the game. So am I to imagine that I just named myself my favorite food? Because if that's the case. Alright. The journey of Sushi and Mac begins. Crack and craggle and again. Oh, okay, no more color. Oh no! Uh all of Chicory's colors! Must have cleaned too hard. <laughs> I gotta go tell her right away. I guess I'm gonna... But, I'm, but I wanna... But I can't leave the room unclean. I have to I have to clean the room. I gotta make sure it's all clean and spiff, spiff spam before I leave, right? Is that the... I don't know. Maybe I get something for that. Is there some cle completionist run to this where you paint every single thing and everything's not so dirty? I really wanna... I'm gonna get this all nice and clean. There's a little part of me. There's a part of me that's like, I can't leave dust on the floor. I shan't ever leave. Well, I mean, was it dust? It must be dust, right? I'm using a broom. This is not a magic paintbrush. It is a broom. I clean the room. Ellipses! Whew. Oh, so satisfying. 
Gotta love satisfaction. Wielder Tower. Ellipses. Odd. Wasn't there color here earlier? Maybe. Portrait. Portrait. Ooh, yeah, this portrait. It's Almond, the classic wielder. One of the first to really show her personality and her coloring. After her, wielder's styles became much more diverse. You have to respect your legacy. Another one. Oh, okay. Hmm, this one. I think this is one, uh, this one is Carrot. It looks like a, it's like a, like a little twee bird. It looks like the Twitter logo going on like, nah, but it's holding like two little brushes down here. But it's Carrot. She was okay. Really experimental. Even at the time, I don't think it was very popular. But I know he has some fans still. That carrot guy. Woo! This one's parfait. She was colorful and heroic, just like Chicory. If she were here, she'd probably say, Don't worry, Sushi and Mac. That is my name. It's fine that all the colors just vanished for no reason. It's totally fine. Don't worry about it. I should probably stop procrastinating. Chicory needs to know what's going on. But me and everybody else needs to know about the other portraits. I guess not. I don't know. I'm just gonna... Can I clean the portraits? Sweepy, 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 sweeping the portraits. Sweeping all the portraits. Ooh, doo, 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 doo. I like this one. I like this one because its eyes stare deep into your soul, making you question everything about your life's existence. Do you exist for color, or do you exist for grayscale? Um, I don't know. Hey, look, paintbrush. Should I touch it, or should I? I feel like I should touch it. But I'm going to check the room first. I gotta let Chicory know first. Chicory! I'm sure she's here, but it's locked. <laughs> Everyone must be panicking. That's supposed to be what's going on. And she just left a brush line right there? <laughs> Something's wrong. What should I do? Uh, cry about it. No, don't cry. Put your broom down. Pick up the brush. That is the only option you have. Sweep the brush. Pick up the brush. Ellipses. What if I stop playing the game right now? And I, and I just go. No, that can't be where this is going. This game isn't that meta, I'm sure. What if I use the brush? Oh, just like she would. I'll use the power of the brush to bring color back to this world. I'm sure she'd appreciate the help. <laughs> Maybe. At least for a little bit. <laughs> Take it. No way. <laughs> of course I'm taking it. I got the brush. We have the brush now, and it gives me a lovely blue cyan color. Achievement get. Helpful. I'll show you helpful. Paint spaceships on everything. Spaceships? Are you sure that they're spaceships, or are they just uh, an infinity sign next to a really odd... Oval? I see where you're going with that. I think everything should be blue. You're blue. You're blue. We're all blue for blue blue. Blue? Blue? Can I do any other colors, or am I just gonna like... All right. Yes, it's nice and blue. Blue's my favorite color, not this kind of blue. Maybe if I paint the door, I'll be able to get inside. Still locked. I hope she's okay. Good thing she has me to help. Yeah, and apparently, did you know, in this world of colors and speculation on the meanings of life, that you can't unlock doors with cyan. That's probably the job of the color yellow. Probably. Or magenta. It's like the whole, your printer won't let you print shit unless you have all the colors already in there. Chapter 1, the dark forest. Dark because there's no color. That's how I feel like this is. That door is a printer. Unless you've got all the colors, you can't go inside. You can't print anything. Even if you're printing in black and white, your printer's just gonna be like, Ugh, bitch, you're out of red. I'm not using red. Why would I need it? There's enough black for everybody. Anyway, tree. Oh, okay. Guess we're going. Hey, you. You're looking a little... <laughs> Blue! <laughs> oh dear. I'm sorry. Hi, Time. Do you know about the sands of time? Do you know about drawing with other people? If you pause with the hamburger icon and select begin co-op, someone else can play with you with an extra brush. Drawing together could be nice. I know it always helps me relax. Thanks, Time. I feel like that story was personal. Yes. My printer is a very bothersome beast. And lo and behold, by the way, if you run out of magenta or cyan or yellow, any one of those colors, you can't print in black and white. You just, you just can't. Despite the fact that the black cartridge is full. But, uh, you know, printer, printer don't care. Anyway, are you sure you're okay? Sometimes my days are going just fine, and then something tiny sends me into a spiral. This isn't one of those times, though. 
There's something big says me to retire. To this time it was the entire world suddenly going black and white. Fly, get out of here, my face. Yes, the entire world is black and white. So, I will make you feel better by painting everything blue. So listen up. Here's a story about a little time who lives in a blue world. And all day and all night and everything she's got is just blue. It's blue, blue, and just blue. It's all, it's all blue. It's just all blue everywhere. Anyway, let's move on. There's too much blue. Let's see. Could anything else be blue? Do I get any more colors? Maybe I get colors elsewhere. Ellipses house. It's locked. But with the power of all three tones. Ooh, wait a second. Hello, you. <gasps> Sorry. Running a bit late today. Shoot. I even forgot to get dressed. I better press start to change clothes. Really? I can press start to change clothes? Oh, they told me something about the hamburger icon, too. Much better. Okay. Come on in. All right. Cool. I'm going to go in. But first, I want to change my clothes. Wait. I want to change my... Yeah, looking stylish, Sushi and Mac. Bandana, bandana, none, none, banana, ban, none, bandana, none, banana, none, none, bandana. Anyway, I guess that's all I have. That's all I get. Colors can change, can, can change a lot. Oh, 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 a dress up, collect. <gasps> Total playtime. I'm 2% done with the game already, and it's already been 10 minutes. My god, look at that. That's pretty cool. I don't know, and the timer keeps going up. Oh dear. Okay, I'm. I'm gonna walk inside. What's up, Cola? Well, hi there, Sushi and Mac. What's new with the tower? I see chicory lent you the brush. Ellipses. Yeah, you can tell. Because it's the brush. You know, it's great timing. I was just thinking our shirt design was stale. Want to draw us a new shirt? Hell yeah, I want to draw you a new shirt. This is going to be Animal Crossing flashbacks. Great. Um, everyone will be excited a new wielder did it. Just do whatever you want, really. Uh, don't forget, you can use LT to erase. I can erase paint? This is some weird voodoo magic in this universe. Shirt! Design a t-shirt so I can draw like... Oh, I only have one color. Uh, okay, uh, I, can go, I can erase like that. All right, do I just get... Can I change my color? No, oh, that's the redo and... Oh, okay, okie dokie. Well, okay, so I want to have nice short sleeves on this. So there we go, there we go. I just do that. Here we go. I'm gonna get a nice like that. You wish you could just erase paint. I feel like that would help you a lot, especially with your uh, with your models and stuff. Now, do I have to... Do I have to draw this outline? I don't know if I have to draw that outline or not. I, I don't know if I do. Wait, I can just... Duh, I can just... I can erase. I'm gonna give it like a tattered clothes style. There we go. Kind of like... Little, uh... Kind of looks like, uh... Something evil. And then... Uh, I don't know. Let's Let's make it look like you've got a choker. Or, uh, I, I don't know. I, I don't really have good space on this, but then we get, we do that. So it kind of looks like you've got that. You know, let's go for the ink ink blot, ink blot test. I like that. So there's one side of the butterfly or the teacup or uh, the trauma you went through as a child. It's it's the test. It's the, um, the Rorschach test. So uh, it's like, it's whatever you see. What do you see here? I see um, horror. I see a dog. I see actually a little dog. On the right, I see the dog over here, and now I see, like, the back of a dog, and now I see the universe in the form of a skull and crossbones. The world is ending. <laughs> it's the end of the world, as we know it. Anyway, what a pretty shirt! <laughs> I wish I had more colors. Finished? Yeah, totally. Wow! It looks great! I, I can't let you leave without taking one! I got that thing! I'll take it right now. Hey, that's not too bad. Now that I look at it from above, it really does look like the roaches that's been crawling around my apartment. Hey, how you doing, Zucchini? <gasps> it's the good Zuck. I'm gonna take a moment to talk to you, Monsieur Zuck. Oh, guess not. Zucchini? Me? Oh, excuse me. I'm, I'm working. Go, go buy something else. All right, bye, Zucchini. Let's... Fashion's a way to show this is who I am. And when it's really sublime, it says this is what the world is right now. But, but what is the world right now? Mm -hmm. A beanie and a pocket jacket. Oh, that's the outfit I'm looking for right now. If you can show it to me, I'll give you something cool. A beanie and some type of jacket. Well, I don't got a beanie. All I got is a bandana. Unless... Hamburger icon? Dress up? I can... Oh, I got my custom tee and my overalls. I like that. That's cool. But I got my bandana. I'm gonna keep my bandana on. I kind of looked at like that... I like that back alleyway style. That's good. I like you. Blue. 
Can I make your whole body? I could just make everyone blue. That's incredible. In a world where everything about you can be decided, it can be under complete control by whoever wields the brush. Oh my god, it stays that way. Look at that. Let's see. Ah. Uh, eh. 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 Whatever it is. Is this loss? Maybe this is loss. I'm unsure. I forget what loss is supposed to look like. Hey, trees, get out of the way! Do I need to teach one of my Pokemans cut to get through this part of the forest? Apparently. I guess I'll go this way. Follow the cyan bricked stone path. Keep, keep on going. I guess I'll color the way to... Oh, shit, look at that. I can break things. <laughs> Supper Woods is this way. Oh, that's where Blackberry lives. The wielder before Chicory. A living legend. Maybe she knows what's going on. But I should check on the townspeople, too. I guess I'll take a look for more townspeople. Hey, you. What's up, Lemon? Lemon? Oh, oh, hello, Sushi and Mac. Everything lost color suddenly. What's going on? Um, why do you have Chicory's brush? I... It feels like something is horribly, horribly wrong. Mm -hmm. Well, uh, if you have the brush, can you color my house back in? Um, you know, however you like. You could, you could use RB to change colors. Oh, I have so much power now. The power of the peach. Look at this lovely peach color. Oh, your house is gonna look beautiful. I, I will let you know immediately, um, Lemon, that I have a huge trouble staying within the lines. So if you're expecting perfection out of this, if you're expecting the, the professionality of our dear chicory, uh, you get none of that. You don't even get like 10% of that. You're you get you get what you get. You get what you paid for, and you haven't paid for anything. I like this lavender though. You can take a little lavender for your Oh uh, um that, that, that thank you, but um I'm sorry. C can you erase it a bit? You can use LT to do that. I will I'll tell you when to stop erasing. Okay. How about a line there? And then a line there. And then a line on the side. And then a line over there. Kind of looks like uh, something lovely. Maybe, I, do I erase the whole thing? Just just tell me, just say when. Just, just say when. Just, just, just say when. You can do whatever you want to say when, uh, Lemon, Lemon. Oh, that, that's enough. Thanks. Um, it wasn't how I liked it before. You can color it again if you want. I'd really like if you colored it d d differently. Wait a minute, your name's Lemon, so I assume maybe you want it. Lemony, lemony colors? Le lemon colors? How about a lot, a lot of yellow? Your name is Lemon, so I would assume you would like this lemony color. How's that, Lemon? Is that, is that okay? Y you cool with that? Are there any other yellowish colors? No, that's the most yellow I can get for that. It's not really lemon. You know, it thinks very, uh, very key lime. But, um, there's been no complaints from the peanut gallery yet, from the owner, not the peanut gallery. You're entitled to whatever it is. Um... Any, any time. Lemon, Lemon, you, you good? Do you, do you like? Do you not like? I feel like you're not liking. Say something! Acknowledge me! Lemon, please! I need acknowledgement! Um. Anything? Oh, are you done that? Um, that, that's fine then. It's just so different from how Chicory did it. I don't know how Chicory did it. Well, but thanks. Okay, you're, you're welcome. I have... When you try your best and you don't succeed... What about you? What color do you want here? Pickle. Oh, hey, Sushi Mac. Uh, is that, is that the brush? Did, did you steal it? No. <laughs> oh, whatever, dude. All right, how about whatever, dude? Oh my God, I can pick up the clouds. I can paint the clouds in the background. Nice. I like that. Pickle, do you need your house to, what's it, what's it like wheel in the brush? I bet it's really cool. It's really cool. Oh yeah, I'm jealous. C can I try it? Yes, go right ahead. I definitely trust you with the power to paint anything. Oh my god. OMG. Whoa, why did you get that color? Wait, I want that color. That's a really awesome fuchsia. It's me. Do I get that color? I don't have that color. Man, I am jelly. I am jelly right now, Pickle. Jelly and Pickle. I don't know how I feel about that. Nibble Tunnel is this way. Nibbly nibbly nibnalls. This is my my house. Sushi Max house. It's my house. <laughs> I guess it's fairly sparse. 
Keeping the tower clean's always been priority number one. But now I can do whatever I want, like make rectangles in my house. It's a folder as featured in Microsoft Windows. Canvas number four. This used to be one of Chicory's paintings. I, I guess it got wiped too. The Pollock Art Kit Academy is in charge of these. I, I see a food motif going on here. Food or things that may or may not be edible or ingredients like pea and ginger. I don't pee ginger. I wouldn't want to pee in my ginger. No, no. How to do, Sushi and Mac. Chicory gave you the brush. Have you developed your style yet? There are so many ways to color. I know what mine would be. I'd use LB to make my brush huge and color everything super fast. That's definitely the best style. Hmm. I'd use LB to make my brush smaller and RSB to zoom in so I can take my time adding small details. No, that's wrong. Your opinion is wrong. I hate you, Ginger. That's a horrible style. That's terrible, but I can make it... <gasps> I can make it bigger. Hey, I can make it as big as I want to be. As a present. Can I get that present? Can I Can I come around the edge and grab that present? Can I, can I want a present? Can I have a present? Oh, I gotta, I gotta go all the way around, seems. Uh, okay. Seems I must do some more exploring to be able to do stuff like that. I was able to destroy plants before. Can I do that? <gasps> yes, I'll come back for you, sir. But first, um, I can destroy those, and I guess can I climb up that? Can I climb? Can I, can I climb? May I climb? Can I climb up this ladder? Maybe? Cannot. Cannot achieve. I cannot find out what to... Okay, that's fine. Uh, you know what? It's probably the way it needs to be. That's okay! We'll just come back and color another time. There's never a bad time to color, I guess. There's something wobbling over here. Oh my god, a cat. Cat? Touch cat. Lost kid? You're a child. I found a lost child. I'm gonna put him in my pocket. Weird. Hey, Basil. Uh, hello, Susie and Mac. We call for a small garden, didn't you? Some flowers grow when in color, but others grow only when blank. If you wish to erase a colored one, you can use LT. Oh. 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 Oh, ho, 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 ho. I think I understand. Maybe I will use that over here. Like, I color these in and then erase more th Wait a minute. What if I stand on top of it and then? No, okay. I thought I was doing something real cool there. Like, if I stood... Oh, wait a minute. No. Oh, <laughs> I can make a bridge. That works out. And then I'll find what this little present is over here. It's a gift. We'll be fine. I got what for a moment looked like Ultron's face to me, and I'm not exactly sure why I thought about that, but it's a pocket jacket. I'll put it in the pocket jacket. Now it's a lavender pocket jacket. You know, I like... Hmm. I think that I should be blue dabba dee dabba die. And then my clothes are lavender. Nice. I wonder if there was anything secret down here. No. No, no. All right. Well, thank you for the tidbit of information there, Basil. I really appreciate that. That was very helpful. <laughs> it's the jacket that that guy wanted. The pocket jacket? Ah! But I also need... Was it a handkerchief or something? I'll keep on searching around. I think there was a... Was it the bandana and the... Can I run? Oh! Oh! Ooh! I can take my time if I zoom in. It's so wonderful. I made a fishy on your roof there. What's your face, Pumpernickel? I'll come back for you. And the beanie. But I haven't found the beanie yet. I feel like I draw like a child. What do we see here in the ink blot? I, for one, see a butterfly. Not that butterfly. Or that butterfly. Or that one. Or that one. It's a big butterfly. Big blue butterfly. I guess I'll talk to y'all over here. What's up, Pumpernickel? Chickory has taught you were worthy of the press, hmm? Well, you simply aren't as good as they used to be. I missed the days of Blackberry. Hey! Chickory's an amazing wielder. Don't you dare diss her like that. You suck, Pumpernickel, in your own special way. Oh, if you like that sort of thing. <laughs> but Blackberry lives just to the southeast in the summer woods. Supper woods. You should go and meet her. I will, Pumpernickel. I will take that into consideration. Pumpernickel. What's up, Macaroon? Hey! 
My Alice ain't got colors now, Moa. Fix it. Give me some, um, tough colors. You got it? Tough colors only. That looks slightly red. Why can I, can I, oh. Well, hello there. Can I like, oh. Oh. Oh my. So, so you want tough color? I'll show you tough colors. This is pretty tough, right? Look at this tough orange red thing. Like, to me, the only looks a little, maybe it's just my screen. That feels pretty tough. Chop, chop. Oi, those colors, they're, they're so tough. God, I love them. That's the toughest kind of colors I ever damn seen. It's like a combination between like peachy skin tone and even a little bit of red and orange. And it just mills, makes me feel like there's blood going through my veins. You really did a backup job. Gotta thank you. I got a brim cat. Nice. And it's lavender. Yeah. I hope you don't have that hat. As much as I love these tough colors. Thanks again. So if I do things correctly, I'll get fashionable items. So maybe Lemon... Lemon? Lemon needs... Maybe Lemon needs her house painted a certain way. I don't know what those colors are. I don't have a reference for how they're supposed to be painted. The only number I have memorized is my parents. I guess I could call them. That they always know what to do when I'm lost or stuck. They're the best! I'll call home. Call home and get a hint on what to do next? Hints. No. I don't need my parents. We're going. We don't need parents. I'll just go out in the woods. I'll find my beanie out there. Hey, you. Hey, hey, you. Hey, you wanna... Wanna talk? What's this? Yum Cave. It's colorful. Is it yum? Yummy in my tummy? Uh, um... Huh. Do I just... Do I just walk through? I just, just walk on through the... No, maybe? Uh, does it need to be a certain color? Maybe? If I, if I color things a certain color... Uh... Maybe I color these. Maybe if I color all the toadstools, I'll be able to turn on the lights. No. Um. If only I knew. Perhaps I should have called my parents to ask what to do next, but. Hmm. No, no, no. I don't need it. Not right now, at least. I am a prideful young man who don't need no parents. But what if I'm scared? Then I may need my parents. Hey, you up there? Lady? Person? Who are you? Mm, I like your... I like the gem on your chest. That should be a... Yeti gem. Yeah. Or maybe that's just your chest. Man, you're really bearing it all out there, whoever you are. Whose name escapes me? It's the luncheon. Hello, beans. Hi, oh, hey there. You see any critters around? My kids went and wandered off for the millionth time. That's because they wanted to get away from their beans. I always tell my children to eat their beans. And I'm like, Dad, we really, really don't want a piece of you. And I'm like, oh, you know what, children? You never learn. You're the one who found my kid. Much appreciated. Well, if you see more, we should send them on over here so they can get a piece of these beans. Sir, I don't like the way that you talk about your children. I'll be keeping an eye on them because they're my kids. Who, who don't have enough beans in their life. They don't have enough beans in their life because I always leave. I'm never home, except now when my kids are missing. Who knew that when my children needed me most, I came home and they were just gone. Well, if you wanted, you can come and say hi sometime. It's fine. It's fine. All right. Um, I want to say hello to you and your kids. Oh, what's up there, little buddy? Can I, can I talk to you? You want to be yellow? How about, how about a nice peach? Nope, just me? Alrighty then. Okie dokie. Well, that's fine. We can, we can do that. I can sit wherever I want to. There's so many places to sit! How you doing, Beans? Anything new now that I brought you your child back? Hey! The kids are alright. I ain't about to take my eyes off them anytime soon, but I'm worried about the others out there. I'm still missing three of my children! Alright, little rascals. <laughs> so sad. I'm willing to bear. They give you the... Bean! It oh my god, you're right! I must find this man's children! You, you're hiding in a tree. Get out of there. Get out of the tree. Hi there, child. Oh, I need to find more children in the rustling bushes. Yes. I will be on the lookout for your children. 
I mean that in the most sincere way possible. <gasps> Children! In the trees! Oh, but how am I supposed to... Maybe if I follow the yellow brick... Follow the yellow brick route. Do -do. Do -do 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 -do. Follow, 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 follow. I found a lost kid. Now you're only missing two kids. Perhaps I have... Ah, three. Is there another one? No, I saw that. I don't like the way that, that tree, the trees... Things pulsate when you hover over them. Like, you get all close and they start pulsating. You're like, ooh. The world is alive with the touch of color. Oh, no. Yeah, yeah, I suppose I should find the children. If I find the children, maybe I'll be able to go elsewhere. So this is a child house. I'm going to remember that by drawing a little kitty on top of it. I'm going to be very thorough about this. I'm going to mark this for my own reference. This is the kitty house. You can tell it's a kitty because of its ears. You can also tell it's a kitty because of its whiskers. Meow. Meow. Meow, meow, meow. Meow, 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 meow. And I think you deserve little happy eyes. Yeah, you're all content. You're like, mmm, kitty cat. And the kitty cat's dead, so they have a halo. Yeah. Oh, just like a father's love. Dead, I mean, obviously. That's, the, that's of course, the metaphor there. Where else could the children be? Uh, anything pulsating? <gasps> a pulsating tree! There must be a child in there! You know what that means. Children! Have I shaken enough? Hi, child. Lost kid. It, you look like you have a halo. Oh, just kidding. I found another lost child. Now I'm gonna take him back to Beans, who will give me the bean E, probably. I swear, if they don't give me the bean E, I am going to be very disappointed. Hello, Beans. Hey! This is my whole litter! Cute, huh? <laughs> look at all their colors. When they aren't giving me a conniption, I feel like I owe you one. I got... You're kidding me. They gave the headband. That is so... Not as ironic as I wanted it to be. I'll wear it right now anyway. It ain't much, but I hope it's handy for you. Maybe if I... Kitten caboodle. Keeping them locked. That is so disappointing. I'm like really disappointed in that. And now your kids are all different colors. And you are... Beautiful. You are a beautiful, beautiful kitty. I feel like I should go talk talk to them anyway. I want to I want to check that again. I just want to <clears throat> so sad. Where were they? Were they inside of here? Yeah, inside of this lost building. Oh, it's beanie in a pocket jacket. It's the outfit I'm looking for. Well, this ain't no beanie, so I'm sorry to disappoint. I guess I'll try to go into the woods. I suppose. That's what I said I wanted to do. I wanted to go to the supper woods. I think that was the next step. Go over here and I can do that and then i go up and then i erase and then i go across again and then i find a present i bet it's the beanie beanie hey it's the beanie still not as ironic as i wanted it to be but i guess i'm satisfied with it now i gotta go back i gotta get what's really mine i need to get what the villagers have promised me well at least we have the beanie now you know what let's just say we got it from beans Let's just say we did. I like it that way. I'll falsify the internet. We'll say, you get the beanie from beans, and everyone's just like, oh, that totally makes sense. No. You get native oats. Whoa! I love that look. You've captured the moment with it. For that, here's something cool. Shades. Oh, yeah. A fashion master knows the right time to wear something. I know you'll wield that with mastery too. Oh, but I think I'm looking for a new outfit now. What are you looking for? The sun over the flowers. That's the outfit I'm looking for right now. Oh. I'm not sure what you mean. Sun over the flowers? Like sunglasses over like a floral shirt maybe? Perhaps? Because I got sunglasses. I don't know. Apparently fashion is going to play a much bigger role in this game than I had originally anticipated, which is wonderful, because I'm happy that that's the case. I've always wanted something to kind of teach me teach me how to be fashionable, because I don't feel that I am a very fashionable individual. I like to clash things a lot, which sometimes translates very wonderfully and sometimes does not. Hey, you! Person! Hmm. Ellipses. Did Chicory give you that brush? Well... No. Yeah. <laughs> yes, she did. So it's worse than I thought. 
You don't seem ready. I hope I'm wrong. <sighs> Come this way. Maybe Chicory's just feeling down. Maybe she's a little hangry right now. Perhaps we should give them some of the townsfolk who all seem to be metaphors for food. Oh, okay. I, I came this way. Um, something with these... Oh, would you look at that? Oh, it bounces! Ooh, we've discovered a new concept. I like that. Oh, but how do... I see if I cover them all up like this. Ooh, is that gonna... If I go that way, can I change direction? I can! When you're on top of the mushroom, you can push your joystick in a certain direction to do that. Flower dress! Oh my god! Yes! Now I've got the sun! Or maybe I need a sun hat. Sun hat? Or sunglasses? I don't know. We'll check them when, I, when we get back. Zoom! I like that. Are there any more, like, wobbling trees? I'm always on the lookout for more children. Lost children. Who may need, I don't know, guidance or something. Oh, there's a little thing that's on the ground over there. It's like, uh, it looks like trash in the woods. Who would put trash in the woods? How disrespectful. I picked up some litter! Nice! We're bringing the world back to loveliness. Maybe this game is a metaphor for pollution and how we're killing the environment and will eventually take us with it. Remember, it's not the Earth that's dying. If we don't take care of it, we're just gonna wind up killing ourselves. Humanity. The world doesn't care. The world's gonna care. The, the world, like, survived the freaking meteor. And life came back. Life finds a way. <gasps> Kitty in the tree. Kitty in the tree. Kitty in the kitty in the tree. I saw you. I saw you shaking. I thought I saw you shaking. Yeah, you are shaking. Well, get out of the. Well, get out of the tree. <gasps> so, like, whose child are you? I found another lost child. More children to be lost. I have five. There's so many kittens. Oh, so many kittens. I guess I can go back like this and go my way around. But it seemed that there was also an area up there that I want to investigate. I don't know which one- every single time I come to a point in a game like this where I am given a choice of where to go next, I'm always like, do I go one way or the other? Which one's the way I'm supposed to go? Because I don't want to go the way that I'm supposed to go, then I'll miss the secrets. I don't want to miss no secrets. Hey, a present! I almost missed the secret. I got the bow. I think I'm gonna put it away. I like my sunglasses. I wear my sunglasses? I have sunglasses I could be using. I don't, I don't know if I should, though. It's getting the... It's dark in here. It would just make it darker. I don't need to be more darker. If it's more dark, then I... You know, not, there's really no consequence. I don't know why I'm not wearing sunglasses, to be honest. I should be wearing more sunglasses. Hey, another gift. Look at that. There's so many things to find. Sun hat. All right, that's, that's the thing. The sun hat over the flower dress. Not the sunglasses, the sun hat. Fashion has this place in the world. Fashion absolutely has this way in the world. This game is totally sick. I finally had the opportunity to paint again. I think the last time I painted something... What's the last time I painted something? I don't remember when the last time I painted something was. Oh, do I have more colors? I think I have more colors. Or maybe it's because I'm in a different location that I have more colors. Hey, that is so cool. I don't know what this does for me. Can I go down? Can I... Hmm, perhaps I should go down here. This feels like the way to go. Down here. Maybe I can climb my way up the vine later on. Oh, I've seen this puzzle before. I like this. I gotta remember which song it was that I discovered this game on. I gotta go back through my Spotify library. I have one song on Spotify liked from this game because I just randomly heard it in the car ride one time and I was like, this is awesome. I love this. So I had to try it. I think I'm going to go back for a hot second and go to that area up there. But I don't remember which one it was. It might have been the Supper Woods. It very well could have been this one. I think we're in the Supper Woods, maybe? I don't remember. Anyway, go over here. Find me a nice little gift. Yes. Nice. I've got me a hoodie. I'll put that away for time for now. I've never been a hoodie kind of person. My youngest brother, though, loves his hoodies. I'll send that over to little Brendan. Not little. He's almost taller than I am. My, my. Time flies. Oh, and now I am a lovely shade of... Mauve? Perhaps? Feels pretty mauve -y. More litter! Yes! I love picking up trash! Makes the world a happier place. 
Without the trash, not with the trash. Trash itself doesn't make the world a happier place. Every time I see trash, I'm just like, wow, that makes me sad. I don't want to be sad. I like to pick up the trash when I can. Sometimes when I go home, my, my, whoa, hi there, kid. I didn't even notice you there. I stumbled upon a child. <laughs> I tripped right over him. <laughs> Whoops, <laughs> sorry, kiddo. I feel so bad for you. Is there anybody else looking for children? Wait a minute, so like, Bean said that this is my entire litter with all four of them. Are there more? How many litters do you have? Beans, you nasty, nasty man. You get around, don't you, Beans? I'm not sure, sure whether to be proud of you or disgusted. For now, I remain to be quite pleased with you. Good for you. Sit on the bed. Is there anything else I can observe in here? Or is it just bed? I can sit on a chair. There are so many places to sit. But what purpose does sitting serve me? To relax? To chill out? That's what I'll do. Yeah. Just sit back, chillax, and enjoy the world. I guess I can figure out whether I, I can go up that little thing now that it's... Oh, can I? I don't know what that does. Hmm. I have not yet figured out this concept. I shall move on and come back again later. Unless there's... Oh, look at that. That's cool. That's really cool that, like, the edge of the screen kind of transitions in as you're moving towards an area. That's wicked. I like that. That is superb. Oh, it's getting dark. Oh, it's the dark woods. Or whatever it is. Maybe that's why. That's pretty spooky. Oh, I cannot... I cannot color this tree. Maybe this tree just doesn't like that dark orange color. Nope. Okay, it doesn't like the dark... Yep, yep. I cannot color that tree. That's foreboding. You know what that means. It's time to head inside. Unless there's something behind it. Anything behind it? Stupid secret. Take this. It's a secret to everyone. No, just walk inside. Step inside. Walk this way. I've got a paintbrush. Yay. Oh, this is spooky. Oh, there's some dungeoneering too. I wonder if this game gets deep and dark. It's already getting pretty deep and dank. Oh, I was... Do I just walk through? Trust the darkness. I trust the darkness. Chaotically colored? Well, I would say... Some would say that I'm a very chaotic, neutral person. So the, cha the chaos is a part of me. I think this would go from a nice... Like, whatever this color was. Mauve, maybe. Purplish. To get yellow. Oh. Hmm. You finally made it. This is what I wanted to show you. I've never seen anything like it. But if Chicory thinks you deserve the brush, it's your responsibility to face it. What exactly is going on? <laughs> the very generic streamer, what is going on? You know all the secrets of this game. If ever need help, just ask. If I need help, I will... Oh, shit. They disappeared. What chaos god do I follow? I don't know who the chaos gods are. I don't know. Give me names. I'll pick which one ever sounds the most chaotic. How about Narlhoptep? Well, okay. I don't know what just... I apparently just clicked the Windows button. I need to go back into my game. There we go. Well, that was spooky. It just disappeared. I don't even know who you are. Maybe they were... Hey, everything's inverted. I like that. That's cool. Oh, okay. Hi there. Um, purple. Um... I... Don't like you! At all. So... I'm just gonna... You're just gonna keep on watching me? Yes. I will... Okie dokie, I'm just gonna move on then. Okay, maybe not. Um, here, you know what? How, how did you like to be a different color? I cannot change my color. Ouch! Whoa, okay, you don't like the color. I can paint him away. I just got paint in its eye. Oh, oh dear. Oh, hi there. Oh, goodbye. Goodbye there. Let's just, let's just, um, let's... Yes, I'll just paint him all over you. What are you saying? Did you say words? Oh, no, no, no. Oh, 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 it's a bullet hell. Oh my god, this game's bullet hell -y. What the? Oh, oh, oh my god. What? Ooh. I could rewind time. What in the world? What in the literal? Whoa. Look at that. Stress and anxiety is caught up with me. Oh, and they move now. If I just keep my paintbrush in one spot. Whoa. Don't touch it again. There we go. I seem hurt. I seem very hurt. And I just paint the center, right? <laughs> no! Don't shoot me with the laser!
laser beams. I don't like that. Oh, don't touch it. <laughs> Wowza. This is giving me spooky vibe. No, 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 not the laser. Please don't shoot me with the laser. Oh, I have to hit them when they're not inverted like that. Okay, that's fine. Nope, you were, oh God, I don't even think I can think right now. Just run from the lasers. <laughs> this is not at all, this is not at all what I thought this game was. I was not prepared for this, mentally or physically. No, stop, no! I understand, I, I, I now hear Lena Rain's music though. This is, I'm getting some Celeste vibes from this, the music, I like that. No, don't shoot your laser. Please don't shoot your spikes or your lasers, please. Okay, laser's fine then, I suppose, as opposed to the spikes, that's okay. And then shoot with the paintbrush. Whoa! Okay, and I'm gonna hit the big one again, right? Just, I'm, I'm ready for it. Please stop. Nope, just run from the laser. Gotta run from the laser. Hit it again. Oh my goodness. With the power, I'm basically stabbing you in the eye. With the power of the rainbow, or rather just one part of the rainbow. That's fine, it's, it's Pride Month. It's, are you afraid of the gays? Is that what you're afraid of, big old eyeballs? Don't be afraid of the gays. They're actually pretty friendly. All of us are kind of friendly. Every single one of the people. No, stop! Okay. I'll make friends with you yet. May the power of the rainbow make you feel fabulous. But but first, but first, let's let's talk about this laser problem that you have there. You realize that can hurt people, right? People and animals alike. No, stop. Stop with the laser. Don't like the laser. I'll sing about my sorrow and fear and every other emotion I'm feeling right now. There's a lot going on. The brain is feeling something. My brain is definitely going through something. You know what? What's my heart rate right now? I gotta ask my Fitbit. Hey, Fitbit, or whatever. Can I ask you that question? Real quick before he goes crazy. What's my heart rate? Come on. No, I have a notification from my mother texting me. 69. <laughs> nice. I like that. Can I paint him away? I can. Nurgle, Slatanesh, Corn, Zinch. I picked Zinch as my chaos god. That was a make friends with you yet if you stab him with the eye with paint i mean friend you are my friend now if you want to be it's okay you i've painted i've painted the camera there we go lord of change change is a wonderful thing we all need a little change i'll continue i like that we'll move on i like this this is very good wow so spooky what was that <laughs> A corruption out of nowhere it started growing here but even I didn't expect it to attack I only got out thanks to you chicory could learn a thing or two from you my old apprentice this is all her responsibility she should never have sent you she's a coward how could I have trusted stop I did paint this room <laughs> saying Stop saying bad things about chicory! She didn't give me the brush. I took it. And I might not know what's going on. Whatever it is, chicory can handle it. I have faith in her. I'm her number one fan and house cleaner. Sometimes the two are distinct. This time it's the same. You don't know her at all. You messed up, kiddo. You have no idea how precious that brush is. You risked us all by taking it. I, I didn't think about that. You're lucky to be alive right now. And if you know what's good for you, you'll take that brush right back to chicory and luncheon. Go! <laughs> that actually makes me feel really bad. Fine. Take Power it up. Your bond with the brush. Oh, is this a game about bonding? With the brush? I love you. Mwah. Whoops. Your paint will now glow in dark places! I love how colorful that was. Nice. Alrighty then. Now it can glow. But you probably should still give it back to Chicory. Maybe. Blackberry. Oh, you're Blackberry! Your bond with the brush grew stronger. But don't let that get to your head. Take that brush and return it to luncheon now. I don't like you, Blackberry. I'd rather keep with my Motorola phones. The Blackberry was cool. The Blackberry stock made me lose money. And that makes me sad. But really, there's more to the world than money, really. 
I wish I could have the green color in here. I don't have the green color. It's only autumn color. Oh, it's autumn. It's like the colors of autumn. I like that. Well, fine. I'll just make it... I'll make the room pretty. I'll give it a nice orange. I'll make the color... I'll make the room absolutely beautiful for you, dearest. Make it beautiful. Make a moogus. <laughs> when Blackberry's house is sus. You know what? I like this better than Disney Queen's idea. Sus. Anyway. Um, I'm sure I'll be back here at some point. It looks like shoes. Hmm. <sighs> This whole game's pretty sus right now. Not how I feel about that. The Yum Cave! I can make things like- Oh my god, I have the magenta color! Oh, it's neon. Ooh, I like that. No, can I please stay in the cave, please? There we go. Fuchsia. Make the bush big. That's what you read? You read Sush? Sush? S-O-S? Help me. It's my subconscious trying to reach for something. Oh, and it makes these mushrooms engorge them. That's disturbing, actually. I'm not sure if I like it when the mushrooms engorged. Hmm. The power of this brush makes the mushrooms get bigger. Hmm. What's yum? <laughs> the engorged mushrooms, that's what's yum. I don't know. I guess we'll find out the yum. Yum is actually an acronym. Yum stands for you, um, meaningless. This show brought to you by nihilism. Nothing matters. Ever. All right, I guess I'll make, my, make myself a new path by run all the way through. And I mean, I guess I technically don't need this to proceed. No, actually, I did need this to proceed. I couldn't proceed before. What do we have now? I got a cord coat. Kind of looks like a corset. Nah. I gotta get my sun on sun hat on top of sunglasses reward first when I go back into town. You know what? I feel like this place is Oh, that is so gorgeous. Oh, that's why I couldn't proceed, because the tendrils from the ground. Oh, but I need to get rid of these so I can proceed next to the mushrooms. Mushroom? I'll just pass on through. Oh, there we go. What other kind of yum awaits for us at the some other side of this cave? No, okay, don't want you to be in like that. No, 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 please, please erase yourself. Can you please erase? Erase. Oh, ah, the crystals will do that. Bring back the pink. It's fuchsia, but I'll allow it. Whoa, I was already in here. Did I do this? I guess I did. How did I get back here? Ah, oh, I'm gonna proceed up this way and see if I can find something. <gasps> A gift. I give this moon tea to you! Do you like the power of the moon? The power of the moon tells you. Oh, gotta turn this off. And then I can proceed back in the after I race that. Go a little this way. Is there anything up over here? Something special? Like, nope, that's just trapping me inside. I don't want to be trapped inside the mushrooms. It's scary. I don't want to be scared. Well, I found another gift over there. Uh, I will proceed in this direction because I haven't been over here yet. Ooh, another gift! If I get... Oh, I gotta get up there. I must find... All right. There's my ledge to proceed upwards. And if I come along this way... This way, this way, this way... Oh, I have nothing. There is nothing here but sadness. Or perhaps... Oh, I see another ledge over there. Ledge. I'll find my way to that little gift. I wonder if it's another f fashionable item. I wonder what kind, of, what kind of fashion item could I be into? I want a scarf. I hope this is a scarf. Or maybe a mining cap. Round glasses. Very chic. I'll wear that later. I like the way that looks. I really like that. So I will turn it on. I will turn it on. Turn it on. I will put it on. I will turn that thing on. I will put on this and turn everything on. That'll be great. It'll be wonderful when I come on back. Come on back to the world. I think. Is that everything in this cave? I feel like that might have been everything in the Yum Cave. 
Oh, you know, that's the area where I was at before. Oh, it's all part of the Yum Cave. Nice. I guess I'll proceed my way back up this way. I could have taken the shortcut, but now that I know it's not... Oh, I had to. Oh. A backtrack. A little too much. Is there somebody in this house again? Oh, that was Blackberry's house. Hehe. <laughs> Sussy. That was pretty cool that I faced some sort of inner demon of this colored world. That was really cool. I like that. Now that it's over, I think I really like that. Nice. I enjoyed that very much so. I wasn't stressed out at all. Apparently I wasn't. Usually my heart rate will go really, really up when I'm in a stressful situation like that. And apparently it just kind of hung around 69 beats per minute. I was not kidding. And so, and that's good. That's very, very good. So apparently I was pretty damn calm. I'm cool with that. I'm gonna go talk to Oats again. I want I want Oats to give me more fashion advice. I need it from the Lord of Fashion themselves. Luncheon. Oats? Hello! I love that look. It's exactly what I've been looking for. For that, here's something cool. I got more glasses, and they're tinted. I'll wear that. Yeah. But I think I'm looking for a new outfit now. Like what? Tell me more, Oats. A uh, howdy to the stars. That's the outfit I'm looking for right now. Howdy to the stars. Howdy to the stars. What could that mean? Stars? Howdy. Howdy to the stars. I bet I need like a 10 gallon hat. How dare. Right? All right. What, what do I want to have right now? I like those those glasses. Are, I, I feel like that really suits me. Howdy to the stars. Cord, pocket, moon. Oh, moon. I bet moon and a 10 gallon hat. Maybe. Unless there's a star outfit. Maybe. No, no. Onward! Back to the Kingdom of Luncheon! I need to go back to that other cave, I bet. Hey, are you feeling any better? Time? Everything's giving me a weird feeling. I'm... So I'm catching a ride to see someone in Brecky. Things always feel better with friends. Yeah. Brecky, like breakfast? Get on up for Brecky. Pumpernickel. Wait a minute, where's the... I need to go see a cat about his kids. I need to let him know that he's got more kids around here. I wonder if... Uh, Mr. Beans even knows about that. What if I go up to him and he's just like, more children? Uh-oh. Ah, look, it's Kitty Place. Honestly, you know what? Kitty Place kind of lies a kitty. The, the kitty kind of looks like they're smoking like a joint or something there. Can I, do I have like a green? I don't have a green. I guess the closest thing I can get is this. I'll get all nice and close. There we go. Get all nice and... Yeah. Dang, dude. All right, go inside. Hello, buddy. What's up, Beans? How you feel? Hey, so... I was doing a head count, and, um... Uh, there's extra kids here. I don't know where they're from. <laughs> but I thought about it a bunch, and... I, I can't... I can't throw them out. You can't just you can't just get a thing of beans and just throw it out. You gotta give it to somebody. They're, they're non-perishable goods. You can give them to people who are hungry. Poor things ain't got nowhere to go. I'll take care of them myself. At least till the folks turn up. It's the right thing to do, I reckon. You're such an admirable cat, there, beans. I like you. Perhaps it's a metaphor that is like is like like in a can of beans. You don't just have one bean. If you've just got one bean in your can of beans, there ain't much beans about it. It's, there's no plurality to the beans. There's just a can of bean. I don't know. I feel like that would get on my nerves if there was only one bean in the can of beans. Surely somebody would have warned me that there was only one bean in the can. Is my house any cooler now? Nope. Still just the windows file. You know what? Let's, let's add a little more color to that. Let's add a little more color. Let's go, um, I think if I uh, kind of go around the edge... No! It's okay, I will fix this. I will, I will fix this. I have a nice little folder. It reminds me of an operating system or something. Make it, make it bigger. I like that color. Make it bigger. There we go. Whoop! Okay, or I'll just eviscerate the entire thing. It's a big old thing of blue. It's a big old thing of blue, but I can change the size and I can erase things. I'll erase down the side. Around the side here, I'll turn it back to purple, and then I'll... Nope, I wanted to do the... Yes! Kind of like, yeah, you know what? It's it's fine. It's fine. I like it. You know what? It's abstract. It's a little, uh... It's got that je ne sais quoi. 
I like that. It's got that je ne sais quoi. Let's go find uh, the... What's his face? Chikori. What's her face? We'll find him in the other cave. Is Chikori the kind of person who, uh, when, when she's feeling not so well, right? She just kind of hides in a cave? Because I know somebody like that. Not a, not a cave, just cave equivalents in a, in a domestic manner. Hey, Turnip. I'm here looking for the wielder. But it was really, really, really tough getting through this cave. So I'm just having a rest here. Okay, bye, Turnip. Oh, am, am I in your way? Yo, oh, sorry. I'm always getting in people's way. I wish I was helpful. That's why I came all this way to say something really important to the wielder. I'll be on my way soon. Promise. Dude, I'm the wielder. Yeah. I guess I'm supposed to go see her too. Oh, I guess... Oh, I need to go back to... Oh. Oh, I need to go talk to Chicory. Oh, I need to go back to Chicory's house. That's not Chicory's house. Gotta go down this way. Chicory, like, like, the chick of Hickory? There's litter back there. I have to pick that up. Oh my god, it's disgusting. Litter. <laughs> litter? <laughs> I hardly know her. Wielder tower. Um, can I open the door now? Get on the floor? Everybody walk in the... Chicory! Are you there? I... Got your, got your brush. I took it. I don't feel bad. But I, I shouldn't have. Sorry. Or maybe not. Um, can I can I come in, Chicory, please? I just want to give your brush back. Fine. Come in. Yo, girl, you alright? Chicory! You're that janitor. Sushi and Mac, right? Yeah! I'm sorry for taking your brush. I was confused with all the color gone. Um, you don't know why that happened, do you? No. Anyway, um, please take it back. Actually, forget it. Huh? You keep it. it what? Huh? I, I can't take this from you. You're... You're the wielder! The best one ever! Look at those years! Not anymore. I don't understand. I... I really look up to you. Th taking this means everything to me. Just take it. <laughs> okay! <laughs> I'll, I'll do it! I'll color everything back in and make you proud, Chicory! <laughs> sure. Now leave me alone. I don't feel good about this. I'll do my best, Chicory! A any tips on using the brush? No. Mm, are you okay? No. I'm depressed. Oh, do, do, you, do you want to talk about it? No, I want you to leave me alone. Go away. Oh, I can't even talk to her anymore. Here, I'm going to leave a little color for you. Hey. Stop that. But, but your jam looks like it could be a little more peachy. Hey. I said stop that! It's annoying! Stop! Oh. Uh, oh. Oh, look at that. Oh, there's no more color in the brush. Something makes me think this is a mental health game. All right, I respect your distance. You have made your point. I have pushed you far enough. I'm gonna, I'm gonna go out here then. Oh, um, excuse me. Hi there. I was looking for the wielder, but um, uh, thought it was Chicory. I'm the new wielder. 
What seems to be the problem? It's the Wheeler Temple! Some creepy trees were all over it. All the colors vanished. It's a total mess. But especially because it's the Wheeler Temple! I thought Chicory might know what to do. So I came here looking for Chicory. I mean, you're not Chicory, so... I can handle it! Okay! Wow, you're a little, you're a little zealous there, buddy, Sushi and Mac. But um, I, I appreciate your energy. You'll have to take the Nibble Tunnel to the Potluck. To Potluck? Is that a place? Potluck! It's a place! Um, but the whole temple went pitch black. It was so scary in here. Walk through the darkness. My demons lie in there. Okay, bye! Back to my demons! Bye, pal. See you later. See you and your demons another time. Something makes me think that this all this is all connected to Chicory. Gotta be all connected to Chicory. She not feeling so good? I mean, not even just not feeling so good. She's got the mucho depresso. We gotta take away that depresso by giving her some espresso. I don't mean like actual coffee. I bet there's a person in this land named Coffee. Something, something feels incredibly right about that. Onwards, it's Nibble Tunnel. Make things grow up, grow real nice. Make our way through. I've learned this concept. I'm familiar with this now. I'm a master at the art of illumination. Dinner's this way. Dinner as opposed to uh, potluck. I was going to potluck though. Is potluck a dinner? Is potluck, a potluck is this way, dinner is the other way. Well, I'm not ready for dinner. Actually, I already had dinner tonight. Dinner tonight was squash noodles, peppers, some chicken, and a little bit of green onion. And it was delightful. It was a lovely, lovely dinner. I was able to, I made it tonight, and I was very happy. My, I don't usually make dinner, but um, my fiance is very pressed for time, so... I took the initiative. And by I took the initiative, what I really mean is I she told me to do it. And I did. Because like I like to I, I like to make food. Given the opportunity to. Alright, I can't see over here. Is there something Ah, I see. I see, I see. What the heck is heat? Are you referring to that extension I've got? Heat is an extension that allows like allows me to clack to track like click events. Like, if you were to click somewhere on the screen, I can, like, see where it was that you clicked. I really haven't figured out what to do with it yet. It's currently not tracking anything. It's just, it's just there. Uh, I should probably disable that, to be perfectly honest, until I find something to, to do with it. But I'm trying to come up with ideas of what to be able to do that for. They've got examples of, like, using it to do, like, little games. Like, you can put a little game that the viewers can interact with during, like, breaks and stuff. But, like, I'm not particularly interested in using it for that purpose. I'm trying to think of something else, and I haven't come up with an idea yet. So I, I kind of I clicked I clicked it and activated it so that I remember what it is uh, to remind myself that you should really do something with sometime. Eventually, it'll be something else. Drawing maybe in chicory, dude. That could be so. I wonder if there's an integration. That is a really good idea. Yo, that is a really good. Whoa, what is that? Whoa, okay, a little bugs. Interesting. That is a really really good idea. I gotta write that down. That is a lovely idea. Where's my pencil? All I have are colored markers, but I suppose that's appropriate, isn't it? That is a really cool idea. I like that. I will absolutely credit that. If that ever comes to fruition, I'll keep it... That's a really good idea. The very generic streamer suggests... Chicory drawing for heat. That is such a cool idea. I'm like completely taken aback by that. It's staring me. It was staring me right in the face. Actually, it wasn't really staring me right in the face. It was staring only the viewers in the face. I can't see the extension. I, I don't get the. I mean, I actually I can look at that. Hmm. I didn't notice that. I don't usually use my mouse on my on my, on the screen. Well, I'm the one with the controller in my hand. Such a good idea. Love that. I I get so much inspiration from the world of the streamers. I thank you very much for that idea, by the way. If I haven't already said thank you, that is lovely. Unless somebody else gets to it first. Somebody probably already got to it first. However, we'll see. I'm gonna have to do a Google search. Black dress. That seems oddly appropriate. For the darkness of our minds. Or, or merely the mind of Chicory. She don't, be, she don't seem to be doing so hot right now. Which is unfortunate. 
One of my coping mechanisms for anything not so happy is to listen to a little bit of music, which, oddly enough, is exactly how I discovered this game. Although, I was, it wasn't like I was in a state of annoyance already. Actually, no, I was in a state of, of annoyance. I was driving to the city, to my home. Therefore, it's annoying to drive around because everybody's a bunch of absolute crazy dudes on the on the highway. So, uh, it was my way to relax while speeding down the road at 70 miles an hour just to keep up with the car in front of me. <sighs> it's fun. It's fun to drive, right? It's very fun to drive. I personally like driving. However, sometimes it is just... An annoyance. Oh, I have to race to get to it before it becomes uncolored. That looks like there's a hole in the wall over there. I will have to investigate that later. Bounce. Okay. Oh, I could have gone that way too. So I'll go over here and pop it on over here. All right. Do 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 do. Oh, goodbye. Lots of color just going away. Oh, there's the... Ah. Oh, I can't touch that. Can't touch the holes. Found another gift. Big star. Oh, yeah. Yep, that's the star. How do you do the stars? If I get a big old 10-gallon hat, that's what I'm thinking. I'm thinking the 10-gallon hats. Got the winner there if I could find one. I'll go back up this way, and it looks like down there is the way that I need to proceed next. So let's get going. Oop, got a... Boop. Popping over there, going over here, going down south to some potluck area. Hello, world of tendrils coming up from the... Are they like... They're not stalactites, because they're not holding on tight to the ceiling. They're stalagmites. Or are they even rock? Or they're just... They may just be tendrils. They may just be tendrils. All the world is tendrils. And and the, the, the animals on it merely... I, I don't know. Receptacles for anything else i don't know does it track all the clicks the viewer make at once so the way that it works to my knowledge i haven't looked closely enough for the code edit to kind of gleam what the the meaning of it is myself uh not yet at least but so what it does is it takes a tally of the area of the screen that gets clicked on the most so if you and a bunch of other people were to click were to click on this area of the screen it'll kind of give you a number from like zero to 100 or something like that to to give you like well of all the screen this is where people are clicking the most and so if you've ever seen if you've ever seen like a heat map before if you think of like a um like a thermal camera like glow in the dark like um thermal goggles like the things that are the most heated will look like a like a reddish color the things that are the least heated colors or the things that are the least heated the most cold will appear like a blue and it's kind of like that but the heat is how often an area is clicked. And I think there's a certain cooldown for it. Um, but, but again, I need to look a little farther into this. It's been one of the projects that I've been meaning to work on. I think I found it like... I think I found it some... Um, I think some TikTok user, uh, a, a, a fellow streamer, a fellow content creator uh, mentioned that. And she was like, it's really, really cool. And I was like, it is really, really cool. I wonder if they have a means to uh, like a programmer to be able to take it and use it for whatever their thing is. And... Yes, it appears that you can. I found, at least I was looking at it a little bit the other day, and it seemed that there's a little, if you find heat extension, there is a page that has like a little thing that you can use to um, kind of start off, to jumpstart your own application for it. I think, you know, it's getting a little dark over here. I got to turn on my secondary light, so half of my face isn't just... <sighs> it's gone dark. Oh, of course it's gone dark because I need to turn the light on. Excuse me for a moment. There we go. Oh, lovely, lovely. It's super bright now and it's in my face. Let's turn that down a little bit. I can only change the color of my light if I have the app open and I have to wait for the app to open. There's the app. Let's, let's dim that down a little bit. That is much better. I can make it any color I want to, depending on how I'm feeling. I should make it pink, says the fiance. We shall make it pink. Pink. Pink? Nope, that's not pink. There we go. Maximum energy! Now it's pink. Now I'm a bright fuchsia. Wow, my eyes. That's okay. Oh. I'm prepared. Okay. Alrighty. It's pink time, baby. What's up, Turnip? Oh boy, am I how glad to see you. I got completely lost coming back. Getting through the dark is really hard. And the cave is full of creepy bugs. 
Could you paint a line for me to the exit? That would really help a lot. Thank you. Um, oh. 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 Oh, there, there you go. Bye bye. Bye. Okay. Bye, Nibble. <laughs> so long, sucker. <laughs> All right. You make me uncomfortable. Now it's pink in here. Oh, I'm going to do the same exact thing, right? Dun, 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 dun. Oh, ah, I see. You can't. Gotta get around the bugs. Gotta get around the bugs. How do we do that? Yeah. It's time to fix myself. Let's see. I guess that means to turn the light back to normal. Oh, yeah. There we go. Nice. Put hat. Put hat. Wear hat. Hat. Sun hat. It's fuchsia. I like that. Or, or perhaps did you mean instead... Anna, would you mind getting me one of my baseball caps from the bedroom? We're on the case. The hat is incoming. It's time to be cool. What's up, Turnip? You can make the line as thin as you need to. As long as I can follow it to the exit. And not step on any weird bugs. Oh, it has to be tiny. Tiny, 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 tiny. Here we go. There we go. I have to be very careful about that. I gotta go around the bugs. I've got a hat now. Yeah. Super stylish baseball cap. Bye-bye, buddy. Peace out, my friend. Styling. I like this. I like this aesthetic we got going on here. It's colorful. Chilling out, maxing, relaxing, all cool. Shooting some b-ball outside of the school. Oh, we doing this again, turn up? Onwards. Down there? Or do you perhaps want to go? Nope, okay. Bye-bye. <laughs> what was up here? Was I already over here? If there's paint, I was. I was. Alrighty. Nice. Come on back down. Oh, thank you. I thought I might never get out of there. <laughs> Please take this. What do I get? A kerchief. Not a handkerchief. Just a kerchief. I'll put that away for now. Like that. Well, I'm going back home to potluck. <laughs> Come visit me sometime. And don't forget the wielder temple. You gotta fix it. Or I'll kick your ass. Bye now. Hey there, bug. Hey there, bug. You, do, you, do something if I touch you? With the paintbrush? <laughs> Oh, bye-bye. Okay, bye. Oh, hi there. Now you're on a tree. Okay. Um, now you're hiding in a tree. What's the secret to the bug? What about this thing? The bug has me so intrigued. What if I give you a different color? Oh, the colors are different. Okay, bye-bye. Oh, I have a little lovely, lovely red now. I love that. Do, 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 do. Why not, though? She is questioning everything I do today. Potluck, but what's up north? I have not gone that way yet. It's to remind... You know what it is, Anna? It's to remind us about how suspicious life can be. You never know what might be too sus. What if I proceed up? There was a little bubble over there. What's that bubble do? I'm gonna paint that bubble. Bubble? Oh, nice. It explodes. We have grenades in this timeline. Oh, okay. Oh, maybe I need to... Can I lead the ball this way? Maybe it's like a fuse. No. I cannot do that. I will have not yet cracked the puzzle yet. So we'll get back to it eventually. My hat keeps going to- whoop, okay. Yeah! For this to be perfect, I have to put it underneath my headphones, but ah, uh, we don't need that. That's fine. Hey, raccoon dude, what's your name? What's your name? Hey! Get out. Hi, Dad. Oh, what's up, dude? Father? My father was a raccoon. I like that. Finally got away from your girlfriend to visit? <laughs> I'm kidding. Um, you know, good to see you, though. Um, son, daughter, person. I like you. Uh, Ma says you're the wielder now. Proud of you, kiddo. How did you find this? Word travels fast around here. Want to give me a hand with something? Uh... I want the holy shop to get colored again. Something flashy. Dad. Your name is Dad. That's all we need to know. Something flashy like like a yellow. Yes. Very flashy. But like a little bit of the 
orange on the oh you know what that's very appropriate i don't have pink here i have red that's all i get here i'm gonna get the rest of it uh you know what here what i'm gonna do is i'm gonna paint the whole thing there we go there i'm gonna get it all like that and then i'll clean up after it a nice pinkish color i want the top to be how about this green thing i don't want to get i don't want to touch the donut I want everything around the donut. There we go. Oh, yeah! I'm not done with it yet, Papa. Sushi and Mac, that looks great. Thanks so much. You're so welcome, Daddy-o. Anything for you, Dad. I love you, Dad. That's why I do anything you tell me to do. Mac and Sushi, I need you to do something for me. What's that, Dad? I need you to give me all the money you have so I can pay off the crippling debt I'm in because of my gambling addiction. Anything for you, Dad, because I love you so much. Oh, yeah, I have something for you. <laughs> it's an invoice for all the debt that I have. Now that you're traveling around so much, I don't want you getting lost. Sweet, a camera map. It's definitely not an iPad. It's one of those fancy new camera maps. Yes, that's what they call it. Camera maps, absolutely. Huh. So you could take photos with it and stuff like that, too. Just press X to open it. X. Uh, I don't know why they call it a camera and a map. Because it's a map and a camera. <laughs> nice. Remember to talk to everybody. I love talking to everybody. Oh my god, I can invert? Oh, there's some, sometimes a different filters. Oh, I love that. Nice. I need to be able to experience the color fully, so I'm going to take the hat off. Oh, that is uh, not the hat. I meant the... What do you call it? thing over there oh it is getting so i love this oh uh -huh. oh i love that you have a wonderful night there too lycos i hope it's nice i hope it's a nice night for the lycos what else do we got i can change my kick my facial feature can i zoom uh zoom 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 hmm. oh well i don't need to take pictures right now or maybe i will you know what i'm gonna do it snap Love it. Do, 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 do. Call us here and need anything. Do, do, do. Oh, bye, Dad. Okay. Oh, he probably went inside, right? Oh, is that my mother? Tapioca. Hi there, Tapioca. Hi. Welcome to the holy shop. Before you ask, no, we don't have any of the color specials. Sorry. Our holy got wiped with everything else. Oh. Wait a second. You're the wielder. Listen, kind of need your help. Uh, we need to design a special new holy. Yes, I will design the holy for you. Sweet. The color special is basically the only reason people come. So, like, you can't kind of decorate away, my friend. Ooh, and I can change color palettes too. Oh, I can. Oh, oh, I have such a variety of colors. If I if I pick a different one, does it change it? No, I just have all these things. I want to make a plaid one. I'm going to make a plaid donut. Love that. I, yeah, I got to erase that. I got to make the brush a little... No, you know what? Oh, and I can change like that. That's convenient. Up and down. Oh, but I can't do it in a straight line. <laughs> I can't even paint straight. Let's see, I'll do a little bit of this action going on. Do I have to stay within the lines for it to be totally... I don't really know. I just want some plaid. Oh. I'll make it as plaid as I possibly can. Then I'll do a little bit of that. Just make it a little smaller. Bring it across the sides. Yeah, make it plaid. Actually, this is not really going to work for me. I need to make... I need a base color. I need base color for that. So I'm going to go with a nice green. Fill the whole thing up. Fill the whole thing up with green. Shame that there's no option to just bucket. Like, paint bucket the whole darn thing. It'd make things very easy for me. It'd make things very, very easy. Go across, and like that, just swiping our way away. We will paint the world. We'll paint the world together! Swipe, swipe, swipe with my paintbrush. Just like that. You know this this donut, this holy? This holy donut? It's not a donut, it's a holy. It's it's giving me vibes from that boss fight. Uh, very, very scary. Making me, making me nervous. Making me very nervous. But it's okay. You know what? I should design it exactly like that. That boss thing. There we go. 
It reminds me of the boss because it's scary. Can I, can I zoom in? Oh, I can't zoom on this one, it seems. But I can be very careful about where my lines are. There we go. It's given me, um... Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtle vibes. Because of the green on the purple. Which Ninja Turtle was that? I don't remember. I never watched a lot of Ninja Turtles. I am the wrong person to be asking himself what the Ninja Turtle was. Because I don't remember. At all. Maybe it was Donatello. Maybe he's the purple one. I don't know. I like that purple. I like that. And then what I'm gonna do... What? Donatello? I heard my fiance scream. I think she said Donatello. Taking a shower. Be right back. Nice. Yes, I did say Donatello. You did say Donatello? Thank you for helping me with that, dearest. I want to make it all nice and ooey gooey wonderful. Yes. Ooey gooey wonderful. Put a little sine wave around the end. Nice. Nice, nice, nice. I like that. Well, now I need to be all careful around the edges. I don't want to go outside the lines or anything like that. I'm not a heathen. I would never. I would never go outside the lines. I need a bigger brush than this. There we go. Something like something like that. Yeah. I'm trying to get cookie dough. You're getting cookie dough? Yeah. What kind of cookie dough? Chocolate chip. Chocolate chip cookie dough? That is a really, really good idea. Can I have some cookie dough when you get back? No, I have to go buy it, so... If I click and hold, does it do so? Oh my god! Whoa! Whoa! You can press the undo button. I know, you're right. Oh my god. I didn't realize that was a thing. Holy cow, I just click and hold and it just fills the whole damn thing in. Wow. I've learned something today. This time totally authentically. Nobody taught me that one. That was totally by accident. Sometimes the- You know what? It was a happy little accident. Bob Ross would be proud. Bob Ross would be proud of this little holy over here. <laughs> it's a holy donut. Get it? It's a, it's a holy because it's a- It's got a hole in it. Yeah. That's that's why. Uh -huh. Make it all purpley. I just want I just want a nice little holy donut. I wanted something like this. I want a nice little holy donut over here. Yes, I do. Nice and green. It's got that purple on it. It certainly doesn't look like you know what? It's a Frankenstein cookie. Or a mutant ninja turtle cookie. A holy. It's a donut. I'm gonna call it a donut. See it's getting me it's throwing me off because done in the bottom right corner of the screen kinda looks like donut in my peripheral vision. So I'm very inclined to call it a donut like I know it to be. Not according to what this town don't say it is. They just stole our donuts from us. It's just holies now. What are they going to take next? Our pancakes. They take the mac and cheese. They're going to take my mac and cheese away from me. They're going to take everything which I know to be a part of who I am. Which is partly mac and partly cheese. But also partly sushi. I don't think I've ever had sushi with cheese on it. Is that a thing? Somebody more experienced than I in uh, sushi cuisine, fish cuisine, needs to tell me if you can put cheese on sushi and it be palatable. These are answers that I feel like I need. Not right now. No pressure. But sometime. Okay, I'm going to change my color palette uh, to be a little... A slightly different purple for the outline. Give it a little two-tone action going on there. Oh, it kind of kicks away some of the other bits. Oh, this is kind of working. Eh, I don't know if I like that. You know what? Scratch that. I don't like it. I don't like the rim around. Don't like the job around the rim. Not a fan. We need something else. We need sprinkles. Sprinkles of all different colors. There's a sprinkle. There's a sprinkle. 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 Actually, these are more like non-parels. They're kind of like, they're kind of dots. Non-parels. Put some non-parels on it. There we go. Kind of stick around the side. All different colors. We need some more pink in there. What kind of pink? Like that. Yeah. Hiya there. How you doing? We're making a holy with rainbow colored nonpareils on them. Or sometimes sprinkles. If it's a if it's long, it's a sprinkle. If it's circular, oh, there goes my hat. My hat is just oh my god. My hat has fallen. I will pick it up in a bit. That or maybe oh, you know what I'm getting? You know what I'm getting? Okay. If I were to make this donut for realsies. The way that I would do it is I would put like that. Oh, thank you for putting the havoc on my head. I appreciate that. Oh, good, goodness gracious. Woo. Oh, goodness, goodness gracious. Okay. Uh, if I was thinking about this, I was thinking about this. And if you were to put like, like, um, 
like oh my god what's the, the the edible paint or whatever for food on the end of the brush you can flick it like that and it'll get all over the donut i'm sure it would look absolutely beautiful great you just found this game wanted to check others uh we were playing it how am i today i'm absolutely wonderful gently place his hat indeed my fiance is very kind about that oh i like this it's my it's my fancy hat it's the um busy getting busy getting dizzy hat it's lovely i like this so far this is my first time playing this actually i discovered this while in a car ride back to uh my home over here in the lovely metropolitan center lovely of philadelphia and so i was listening to the soundtrack of celeste because at the time i was playing i was doing a celeste playthrough and i was like i really want to listen to this music because it's got that vibe and then all of a sudden this popped up because the person who did celeste uh lena rain also did some of the music for this game and i was like i gotta try it and i saw that the summer sale was going on for steam it wasn't on sale or anything i just i just wanted it i had that urge to get it i think that's a beautiful holy there I like that it's a very small game and it looks absolutely charming I, I felt the same way i honestly thought you know i was i was gonna say i thought it was just totally chill not necessarily i will say nothing more but it can get a little get a little cerebral so to speak Oh, lovely. I'll, I'll get started on extracting the colors. I'll have to make a ton. I'm sure people will be lining up like any minute. Okay. Uh, I think you need a little bit of that. Then you need a little bit. Of... What other things do you need? I'll help you color up there. Um, whatever your name was. What was your name again? I, I forgot what your name was. I am so sorry. <laughs> I've forgotten what your name was already. Oh, I need more of that red. That red is perfect. Where's the red? I think the red's good for the tables. Yeah. All surfaces done get the red. Kind of like that. It's great fun indeed i know i've always been the kind of person who likes like i like i like games that are nice and simple but i really like games that make you think i like anything that really makes you think any type of show that i watch like it makes if it makes me like question my humanity a little bit i like it which which sounds like really really weird but like honestly i feel like some people sometimes i don't do enough thinking in this world. actually i think all the time i'm the kind of person who is always up in my head thinking about goodness knows what but you know what that sounds that sounds that's sometimes okay sometimes it's okay to think about things because uh better to be thinking about something than i guess thinking about nothing right no oh do you need more painted do I need to paint more there we go i'm sure you're fine there so have i seen bojack horseman i haven't actually but it is on my list of it is on my list of shows that i need to go through and watch based off of recommendations for at least two friends of mine it is on the list oh my god people are inside now Including, uh, what's the, what's her face? Turn up! You want some holies, my friend? Yeah, isn't that an awesome looking, isn't that an awesome looking holy peppermint? You're the deal wielder, right? So you desire this holy? Wow! I really like it. Ah, it really speaks to me on a deep level. I can't wait to see what else you do. What about you, Turn up? I love holies. They're like perfect circles from heaven. With a void in the center. It reminds me of my own void. Hmm, voids. Wow. Now, I wouldn't agree that they're amazing, but I do try my best, and I do very much appreciate the compliments. I kind of use the streams every once in a while to practice my own voice acting stuff. If I, if I, if you could even call it voice acting at some point. Love it. The Void is the best friend. Love the Void, my friend. That's that's what they say. That's a song by a band called Palai Royale. And I like it. It's a little hard rock. If you know hard rock, Palai Royale. Love the Void. It's a great one. Love the Void, my friend. You don't know where it ends. And then something else with the song. I don't know all the lyrics, whatever. Young people these days, they barely make time to talk to others. Maybe they interact once, but then they move on. Don't they realize how much they're missing? I try to interact with everyone multiple times. Dude, you're sounding really meta. But I like that. Thanks, Guac. Is there mole anywhere? Is there a Guac and a mole? Probably not. What's up, Macaroon? Oy! I'm so pumped for a holy! I'm getting fired up! The colors are cool, too. I wonder how they get those food on food. With a paintbrush, my friend. What's up, Raisin? Yeah. It's holy time. Love it. I love the holy. My favorite thing to do. Take me to the holy dimension. You know. The void. It's all we need. It's all we need is the void. So like, so like, Guac, were you implying that I should talk to you again? Even when they do interact, they'll use B to skip through the conversation quickly. 
Why can't they take the time to pause and listen? Maybe I'm just slow. Well, I mean, guacamole is incredibly viscous, so if you take anything after the food, perchance you are. Oh my god, look at everybody here. Treacle, custard, there's so many people. This is awesome. Oh, there's somebody in the tree. Come on out of there, child. Come back to the world of the living, my child. Come on. There we go. I'm gonna take you back to not your father, but some other dude who just kind of takes care of children. We don't know why, but he does. He's not just satisfied with his own kids. He needs more. Everybody deserves a color. I love the fact that you can color everything in this game. Or, well, not necessarily everything, but a lot of it. And you can pick up trash. I love it. Let's see. What's up, Grits? I'm glad my little bro turned up is okay. I love the kid, but he's a bit of a goofball. I always gotta keep an eye on him. Yeah. Hello! Please don't tell my family about how I got lost coming here. I'll never hear the end of it. Gotcha, turn up. Fritter. Hello! Hello! Hey. Our family's been here in Potluck for generations since before the Art Academy. Did you know Mouse was one of the first wielders? I don't, don't underestimate us just because we're small. I am a small individual, and I agree with that on a personal level. What's up, Granita? The Art Academy and the Temple are as old as dirt! <laughs> I have to say dirt and not shit because it's supposed to be child-friendly. Oh, excuse me. But all around it, Potluck has changed over the years. Kids travel here from all over the school. We're lucky to be surrounded by family here. I suppose you are. I'm glad with that. What's up, Triacle? The new wielder, what an honor! Did you come here because of our boy Turnip? Yes, yes, we sent him! We saw the strange growth of the temple with our own eyes. Did you see the eye in the other place? Terrifying! Reminded me of my own mortality! We're all gonna die one day! And what's worse is the way it was completely blocked off. Reminding me about other limitations in my life. Yeah, we were really coping to go see the art. Not, not like all that other stuff, but, but mostly just the art. It's usually very lovely, except when you start questioning what it means to be human, or the lack thereof, because we're all animals. Same, bro. What's up, Clementine? Clementine and Radish, two flavors that I, I wonder if those flavors get along. Hmm. Clementine! Sweet Clementine. Clementine! Suchimek! Muff said you might be visiting! How amazing! Oh, this is my BFF Radis! I'm so honored to meet a famous talent like you. Um, thanks. People like your sister and I bust our butts every day, practicing arts, honing our craft, just to get a shot at maybe wielding the status like yours. You must be some kind of genius. Um, come to a class sometime. I'd love to learn from a master like you. I'm not sure if I appreciate your sarcasm. Sorry, I promise she's not always like that. She's right though. Sh sh she is? Definitely. You should come to an art class. Oh. They're inside here. Do it, dude. You strike me as a surfer dude, Clementine. You really do. Or super dudette. Su surfer person. Right? I'm surprised everyone already knows I'm the wielder. Yeah, like, did, does news get around? Is there the internet around here? Word travels fast, dude. Students here are more interested than anyone. To know who the wielder is, it's a big deal to some of us. Not me. So much. But I'm, like, super stoked for you, dude. Oh, you just used the term stoked. You absolutely either smoke a ton of weed... Or surf. Or are me. I don't... I don't smoke, really. And I don't surf, really. Never surfed before. Can't say the same about the latter. What else you got over here? Radish. Wow, you really showed up. Are you gonna, like, take a class with us? Can't wait to see how good you really are. Sure, Mel. Quinoa! Oh, what an honor to meet you. I'm a professor here at the Academy. No matter your skill level, it's always good to practice and study. Want to take a class with us? Yes. Oh, uh -huh. take your places, everyone. I'm going to teach you something good about the paintbrush. Today's lesson is very special. Sushi Mac, the new weird, is here with us. This will be 
interesting. Everyone get your brush styles ready. Um, what, uh, what are those again? Oh, Raisin. Oh, you're Raisin. Well, now you sound like that, Raisin. You really should know the terminology by now. I like to think that this dude smokes like one of those long French cigarettes in class and nobody cares about it. Why don't we hear it from our special guest? <sighs> yeah, brush styles. Let me tell you something about brush styles. Uh, sushi Mike. Oh, <laughs> well, it's a, a, a special machine, a funny smell. It's something, it's something in your nose. Follow your nose for the fruity taste that shows. Toucan salmon, Fruit Loops. That's for um, uh, it's for it's for little little bugs. Your friends, your friends. <laughs> to 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 uh, eh, decorate. You get stronger. Yeah, yeah. A funny smell for your friends to get stronger. Well, in a certain light, I suppose you're right. Could you demonstrate one? Oh, uh, um, eh, I left them at home. I'm sure you have more important things to remember. Take this starter set. Strokes? Different strokes, different strokes. Different strokes, different folks. The brush style starter kit starring you, Sushi and Mac. Or Mac and Sushi. I feel like I should have switched that. Remember, you can equip the brush style at any time using the up, down, left, right buttons. Just is that one that's that's the one if you're curious that's the one all right for today's assignment i want you all to draw something that expresses joy you mean like the void no raisin not the void the void does not bring joy to us i think that the void drinks brings joy to everyone they just don't know it it doesn't feel like joy get to it then all right, um, what sparks joy? Fire. Fire sparks joy to me. So, oh, I can change around my, ooh, I like that. What sparks joy to me? The fires of love. So, I bet if I, oh. Oh, would you look at that? If I click and hold, I'll fill it all up with hearts. That's beautiful. You know what? I, I have an idea. I have, I have an idea. I have a grand idea. I have a, an evil, evil, devilish idea. Well, not really evil and devilish. I promise. I promise not evil and devilish. I'm gonna go with this color. And I'm gonna fill... Actually, you know what? We're gonna go with the yellow and fill the whole damn thing up. Whole thing gets all yellow. Because it's it's the goodness of the sunshine. The sunshine makes you feel good unless it's burning you. Burning your skin. In which case, maybe not so good. And then... We're going to take this lighter pink color, and I'm going to use that, uh, actually, no, no, the, the, the bigger fuchsia, the more powerful fuchsia color. Use that with the big brush to make a big thing of fire. Fire, my friends. Fire. Well, up here, a little, little, things like that. Kind of get the general shape of this uh, big old flame I got going on here. And then the rest of the body of the flame, like that. Oh, didn't want to do that. There we go. Fill the rest of that in. Don't do that. Make it look beautiful. It's gonna be, it's gonna be fire, absolute fire. Just like, what else is absolute fire? Forest fires. Those are pretty fire, quite literally. Very, very fire. Very fire. Fire wow. I'll round this out a little bit. Give it a little more details. Little, uh, little flame spikes over there. Give it some texture. Wrap it around again. Smooth it out. Smooth it out a little bit. That'll be great. You're gonna love it. You're gonna love this fire. It's kind of fiery for now. I need more. I need more roundedness up here that goes into a little spike down here. Because fire is both sharp, bracing, and yet oddly comforting. Fire can be a lovely thing. Fire can be a liberator. Give yourself into the fire, and perhaps you'll learn things and feel feelings that you've never thought you could feel. The fire brings joy to me, Sushi and Mac. Because what the fire does is it provides sustenance. The fire allows us to cook our food. Cooking our food means we get delicious, delicious meals like mac and cheese, 
You need a heat source for mac and cheese. Otherwise, your pasta is all hard, crunchy, and unfortunate. However, fire can also burn. But sometimes burning is just a new beginning. Some forests require fire in order for the seeds to bloom into more trees. In that way, the fire brings warmth and happiness and even life to the most barren of places. I don't exactly know what places use flaming specifically, but some forests do. Sometimes they do controlled forest fires, uh, at least in my parents' area, which was back in New Jersey. But I'm making a little fiery. A little more fiery. Like that. A little fiery. It's, it's fire-esque. Like that. Feels pretty fiery to me. Then... I'm going to use this right over here to give a little... Give a little more depth to the flame. A little more depth. Kind of like down here. Another layer of the fire down deep within. Yeah, I like that. It's fire in the flames. Did the fire in the flames? I think that's how that song goes. If I'm thinking of the right one. It's the other it's the other song. It's the one well, of the other rock metal songs that just like It's very no, didn't want to do that. I clicked and held too hard on the trigger. I kill the fire. That'd be sad and unfortunate. Very so fortunate. Nope, that didn't work. Go down like that. Eh, that'll work better for me. I'll be a little more careful around the edges. I'll fill that in in a hot second. It's all about... I don't know. I'm, I'm really not a painter. I would, con would not consider myself much of an artist, to be perfectly honest. However, I do make art sometimes, and when I do, it feels, it feels pretty good. It's liberating. The, uh, the opportunity to be able to go into my sketchbook and draw literally whatever is on my mind, or what may be lurking in my mind that is yet to take form, is awesome, really. It's a wonderful little opportunity. So now what I'm going to do is I am going to, as best as I possibly can, uh, put some hearts in here. Oh, I can do that from the... Uh, there we go. I'm gonna put some hearts. From the heart of the fire, from the begin, from the start of the fire, I go outward and make the hearts. Yes. There we go. That kind of... Hey, you know what? I like that. It's a little abstract. Maybe even a little, uh... Not very pleasant looking. Uh, but you know what? It's got, it's got the heart. I think it's got the heart. I call this one... Heat. Yeah. That's got a lot of meanings to it. I think there's a lot of meaning in that. Heat like fire. Heat like animals. In heat. Anyway. Alright. Brush is down. The brush is down. Now we'll move on to the critique phase. Time to show your work. Alright. What do we got, everybody? We've got heat. Wow. Good evening. This is my latest art piece. I call it Heat. It's about the heat of love. Or the heat of anything else. Welcome back, dearest. Did you grab the cookie dough? Yeah. Nice. Can I paint more while I'm on here? Oh, I could if I... Nah, I can't. I can't modify my own drawing. Wow. So this is the work of a real wielder. Yeah. Looks so good to look. It feels so good to look at. I look at this and I'm just filled with some sort of innermost joy. Your sparring use of magenta is pleasing. There's a good attention to detail. The distribution of light and dark is pleasant. I like how you interpreted joy. My joy doesn't feel the same as this, but I feel like I really understand yours now. Excuse me? That does, does no one else see how... Ellipses. Looks great to me. I want to take it home to mom and dad. Well, that's it for now. Next class, we'll do a master study. I hope you join us. And everybody, keep practicing. Practice makes perfect, ladies and gentlemen. That probably sounded really weird on the microphone. Tisk tisk, my friends. Always practice your work. Clementine, that was awesome. I guess everyone's extra surprised because the wielder usually comes from the academy. Uh, people study you but to get like noticed. What about you? I just like art, dude. <laughs> Being the wielder is a whole other things. Are you enjoying it? Yes, I suppose so. But how does Sushi and Mac feel like they're enjoying it? I feel like... Nah, I think you're totally into it. Cool. I hope you follow your bliss, dude. I love that. Follow your bliss. Follow your bliss. 
Listen up. Everyone here may love you just because you're the wielder. That doesn't make you a real artist. So, don't go get in a big head, okay? That's all. Quinoa? Class is about to start. Want to join us? Ah, uh, you know what? I'll wait till later. I'll come back for another class. However, I want to see what's behind door number two. Hey, there's a little back area. That's cute. I can put hearts everywhere. That's so cool. Hearts all around because the world revolves around love. Or or currency and monetary value. Honestly, I guess it depends on who you ask. What's up, Karkata? I, I, I'm not familiar with that food. You know what feels real good? Double tap in the draw or erase button. Oh yeah. It makes a big, satisfying blob of paint. Just thinking about it gives you the shivers. Really? Oh? Oh! Look at that! Oh, look at that! Yeah! I can make polka dots! That's so cool! Now I've got hearts and polka dots! The world revolves around... spheres. Arts are a visceral thing for me. I do it because it brings me pleasure. I love double tapping to just... smack stuff with color. Brush styles are really fun too. Oh, yeah. I respect that, Karkala. Brussels sprout. You're the wielder. Wow. It's a pleasure to um, meet you. I'm working hard on the art, too. I hope I can be a wielder someday. Maybe you will, Brussels sprout. Do you want to um, see some of my art? Thank, I guess. Would you like to see some of this man's art? Want to see some of my art? Yeah. No, mm. mm. oh, never mind. It's not good enough yet. I I also really like video games. Um, I'm the best in school at Mega Mass Sisters. I never heard about that. Never heard that game before. I I only know Super Smash Brothers. I'm terrible at that game. <laughs> oh, okay. Um, you probably uh, wouldn't enjoy playing with me then. Aw, have some more faith in yourself there, Brussels Sprout. And Dream Flutist. Have some more faith in yourself. I'll play... What was it? Mega... Mega Mash Sisters? I'll play Mega Mash Sisters with you. Razor, what do you got? Do you like making art too? It's my favorite way to relax. I like holding down the draw or the erase button. And keeping my breasts nice and still. Have you tried that? I did, actually. I, feel, I figured that out, actually. It fills things up in a... Satisfying way. Yeah. Like, just, if I wanted to make... Oh my god, there's cookie dough right here. It's time to indulge in a very unhealthy way. Don't question my habits. Hmm. I'm very sorry. Bad example. Lots of stuff makes me feel up and down. It's really hard to make sense of it all. When I sit down and make something, I feel this kind of clarity. Am I putting that stuff out of me? And onto the page, I can kind of start to make sense of it. Making art's a good way to spend your time. I guess not everyone loves it as much as me, but I feel like it's good for everybody to do. At least a little bit. Everybody do your art. However you want to do it, do your art. What was that? Anna says, if your art is with dead bodies, then don't do that. I, for one, will not make such comments. I'm not your parents. If you've got dead bodies to spare, to use as a brush, paint, or, um, a canvas, I suppose, do with it what you will. But don't tell the officials. They'll get you. What are you doing there, pal? How are you okay? Couscous. Couscous. Oh, what? Don't know what to do. The people of Ele... Ele... Eleven Seas? Eleven Seas is trapped. There was some kind of rock slide. And my family's there. And they all wheeled their car to mom. Nice. But I don't know what anyone can do about it. I can help. I'm the wielder. Did you not hear? I'm the new wielder, actually. But doesn't that just mean you're an artist? What can you do about falling rocks? Oh. I don't know, actually. But, but I'll figure it out. Promise. Mm. My family is still in the Seas. 
I just happened to be here at Pocklock when the water rocks fell. I can't tell if I was lucky or not. I hope they're all okay. There were horrible tremors that loosed the rocks. Then all the colors vanished. And the terrifying trees grew all over the temple. And what's going on anyway? Is it the end of the world? Yes. Oh, I'd ask Karma, but he's trapped in the 11 seals too. I came to Pocklock to get groceries. I'm still holding the food I bought for them. I love how you just keep on talking. I like that, Couscous. You remind I vibe with you. Oh, I hope they aren't going hungry. I know living remotely has its risks, but we never really thought about this happening. Oh. I'll find your family, Couscous, and maybe bring back all of them. Maybe. Color it all. Bring color to the whole room. Oh, whoa, whoa. It colors within the lines. Oh, that is so cool. It does color in a really satisfying manner, unless it's already not colored before. That is so cool. Oh, I love that. Can I do the red as the outside? Oh, I love that. That is incredibly satisfying. Satisfying, right, dear? Mm -hmm. Yeah, do you want to try? Do you want to try painting? Oh, here, you want to try the outside? Oh, yeah, give it a shot. Uh, so you can move around. You can move around your character with the left joystick, side one. Side two allows you to move the paintbrush around. You can use this button, the side one bumper, to change the size. Side two bumper allows you to change color. You can zoom in with the side two uh, oh my God. joystick. And I don't know what this one does. Just kidding. Doesn't do anything. What's the one where it just blows up? Oh, uh, side two... No, not that. Oh, not that one? Oh, like make it bigger? You, like, oh, click and hold the uh, the, the the paint button. Yep, just do exactly like that. Ah! Oh, you moved around. Nice. Okay. So you click and hold that until it goes everywhere. Hmm. What do you think? It didn't work. Oh, what do you get? We're gonna click the uh, whatever the button for. What's going on? Hold on a second. Did I tell you to click the right button? Hey. Oh, it's this button. It's this trigger. Oh. Side two trigger. Oh. Welcome back, Dream Flutist. Now we've got ah. Anna on the controls. I don't want that. So now you click and hold on that, it'll just go and fill in everything. That it, I think it colors in everything that's not surrounded by a big border and is not already colored in. I really don't like how everything's like colored in now. Well, you did ask for that. And you can erase with the other button. I, but I think I you just figured that it out. out. I think you just figured it out. I'm nice. I'm doing that. I'm going to make nice. this all white. How All white? All right. I like the white color. It looks good with the green. Right now. I, don't, I don't remember who I was talking to a while ago. But in terms of art, there was somebody who had mentioned, like, you know what? A lot of people don't, like, use white space, like, blank space to their advantage in a painting or in a drawing. Like, you don't have to fill up the entire canvas for it to be, like, really expressive. Sometimes the emptiness of nothing there speaks louder than any sort of color that you can put there. I think it's metaphorical in a way. I like that. It makes you feel good about the emptiness. The void, if you will. What kind of color are you thinking about making the, the houses? Are you going to do the houses too? No. No? Just keeping them nice and gray? It's kind of cool. This is, like, very comic book styly, I feel. At least with the way that they kind of texture the houses and stuff. It's very cool. Hmm. I'm supposed to be doing work. Dream Fluence has had some conversations about the the absence of color as being very, very expressive in terms of what you can do with white space. I don't know if it would. Maybe it would with you. Just silver conversations, perhaps. The only reason I think of that is because I think the last time I actually painted something, there was rather, there was a lot of white space in it. And I almost felt bad about it. I was like, why did I leave so much white space? And I and I remember talking to somebody about it. I mean, it was either afterwards. It was probably afterwards. But they were like, it's okay to leave white space. I was like, very good point. I like that. And with the absence of sound too. Yes. Especially in like songs that kind of really play towards some sort of like emotion or trying to send across a message. Like I feel like classical music does a lot with not necessarily absolute silence, but the way that dynamics play a key role in a lot of classical music seems to speak a lot more powerfully than 
you know, it just being like up and loud and crazy and bombastic. Although, to be perfectly honest, those bombastic uh, classical musics, I, I can't really name any. I'm not very good on my classical music stuff. Very enjoyable to listen to. Like, um, I'm blanking. Classical song that sounds bombastic. I don't know, for some reason the flight of the bumblebee came to mind. Anyway. That's the only, that's the only thing I got. I don't know why that popped into my head. That's not very bombastic. It's quick. Fleeting. And dare I say anxiety inducing because it's just like Gah! There's so much going on. I can't I can't deal with all this buzzy buzzy bee. I mean it also makes me think of like actually a bee flying around my face. Really getting up all up in my grill. I mean, really, if you don't bother the bees, they really ain't gonna bother, bother you. But, like, uh, most most of all, I think the best way to get rid of bees is just blow on them. Uh, somebody told me that once upon a time. If you blow on the bees, they think it's the wind, and then they don't... They're not gonna sting the wind. They certainly wouldn't sting you, because you're not the wind. They don't know that it's coming from you. At least that's what I was told. Use of silence was the difference between Baroque and classical era, eras of music. Really? Oh. It's no wonder I was able to think of, at least most foremostly, classical music in a sense. Without being- I wasn't able to bring a particular one to mind, but... I definitely recall, like, if I've definitely listened to classical music before, that makes use of dynamics and silence. Although, I don't know, I guess that- is, is that like a- that's a classical era? Oh, but between Baroque and classical, Baroque being... not... classical. I'm not super good on my musical history terminology terms so i do apologize for that i'm probably getting them mixed up it happens sometimes it does indeed happen sometimes okay i'm satisfied ish satisfied i like it between bach the difference between bach and beethoven nice okay. do johan that. sebastian bach See ya. peace out dearest thanks for drawing with me back to Whatever else. Classical versus classical. Lazy. Didn't capitalize. Oh. 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 Uh, like the proper noun versus the... Like the actual like classical era versus like music that happened to be classic at the time. Salt and pepper. Oh, salt and caramel. Caramel. Yeah, I like that. Salted caramel is a good combination. How dare and welcome to the clothing shop. Wop. Swap not shop. In today's modern world, who has time to look for clothes, am I right? Do you ever, ever see gifts just out of reach? Or worried you missed something entirely? Well, now you don't have to worry. We can get you just about any clothes about out there. Just give us a piece of clothing, you take its place. Hence, clothing swap. Now service a lunch and dinner sub awards. And a nipple tunnel. Wanna swap a piece of clothing? Yes. Great, first of all, uh, pick what clothing you want. The premise of this game, at least from what I can tell so far, is that there is one wielder of a magical brush. That wielder of the brush can bring color to the world however they see fit. I think the previous color wielder had a lot of like gradients and almost tie dyedness about them. And now we, the janitor, one of the previous wielder's biggest fans, found the brush outside of the room one day and was like, um, door's locked. I'm gonna go see if I can do anything with this and started drawing around and then we just realized in the last chapter that the current wielder of the brush who kind of gave it up um, is very, very depressed right now. All of a sudden, like, it starts with the game being very, very filled with color and grade and then all of a sudden everything, like, you keep, there's a big boom and all the color just disappears. And, um... At least from what we've found so far, if you piss off the previous wielder, wielder enough, she has the power to make the colors go all the way at the same time. Probably because she was a wielder. So I feel like there's a lot there's a lot going on here in a cerebral way. I don't know. But that's kind of what it is. We're trying to bring color back to the land, it seems, and get rid of all the bad voodoo tree things that are preventing us from coloring. So you're taking the scarf. Yes. Okay, now just pick something in exchange for it. Um, here, take this kerchief. I want a scarf. So, you want to give us the kerchief for the scarf? Yes, I do. Okay, Caramel, go find the scarf. Swap it with the kerchief. Oh, bye-bye. What did you do? 
I love that. Zoom, there's the night she go. Done! I got this car. I'm cool with that. Thanks for your business. You're welcome. I'm a run for the clothes stop. You can run clothes out to any gift and picnic. If you want to do any swapping, talk to Salt. The clothing swap was Salt's idea, actually. I thought it was sounding fun, so I'm helping him out. We're still figuring out the details as we go. I think it's nice to help folks help find clothes they like. I'm um, not really a fashion guy, though. I just really like running. <laughs> zoom, zoom, zoom. I like you. I like you, Caramel. You're cool. Oh, hello there. Hi, P. I heard there was a cool colored place out here. So I had to see. And I love it. It's so bold, simple, and striking. Keep up with the good work. Will do, P. P? That was your name, right? I mm, like that. Oh my goodness, it's so striking. I just realized how striking it is to walk from one color to another, uh, one area to another, because the colors are just completely different. Or rather, there just is no color. All right, so I think what I'm going to do, I, I like falling in love with just painting things. This is really, really cool. Are you pink pen? Pink pen? Um, I don't believe I've seen the pink pen anywhere, unfortunately. Do you want something pink? I have pink markers that you can use in the meantime. No, I'm Oh, okay. So please give me a pink My sincerest of apologies. I do not have it, unfortunately. Well, I'd like to think that I take personal responsibility. So let's do it again. Yeah! Now all the paths are a nice green color. Meanwhile, the grass and stuff is all a nice red. What's up, Barley? Back when I was young, it was all about abstractionism. That's when mustard was the wielder. Everything was weird. But you know what? It was good. Nowadays, people want things to be beautiful. But I liked when wielders were wacky. You ask me, Prout looks the best place in picnic. Bigger than luncheon, but not so big and noisy as dinners to the north. The Art Academy fills the town with bright creative kids. We're right on the edge of the big drink. Nothing makes me happier like listening to the ways more than night. Have you seen a metal workshop east of town? There's a fellow who crafts wonderful things there. Sometimes you can hear him walking late into the night. I didn't know about that, but thank you, Barley, for enlightening me of that. I want to bring. I want these trees to be little yellow, little yellow trees, yellow tops of the trees, yellow flowers, yellow flowers, yellow flowers. Like that, like that. Yellow flowers. Boop, 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 boop. All the leaves are. Whoops! I forgot. I can. Can I actually undo? Oh, I don't think I can undo from this menu here. That's okay. I can just quickly fix it. No problem at all. This area. Oh, so this place was called Potluck. I think. Very calming. I like that. Dab on the haters. Are there haters in the chat? There we go. I have no shame. Usually, if I dab, Lycos Lore threatens me. But he's not here right now. He's gone. So, that's okay. I have no fear for dabbing now. I don't need to worry anymore. Because he can't come get me here. He can't get me here. I'm safe now. I'm going to make the waters this nice orange color. Oh, I don't think it works that way. Oh, it appears to not work that way. Plot, plot twist. You're Lycos Lore? What? Glenny boy, what you doing? You gotta be true to your real self. Be to your true self, Glenny boy. I don't you know. I don't know. I don't know. That seems pretty sus. I'm just saying. You're, you're telling me that you're one of my best friends? I've known this man for years. I feel like I'd be able to see if he was in disguise. You're testing my relationship here. Lycos. If that's your real name. But, uh, I think it was sometime in the year... I think it was the, the end of the year 2019. Where we were all hanging out. And I think as soon as the new year happened, I was just like, oh, you know what we have to do? We have to dab to reign in the new year. And I went and I did my dab and he's just like, I will destroy you if you dab again. And I was like... <laughs> I'm not scared of you. <laughs> He's like, I'm going to get you. He didn't actually get me. It was more of like a metaphorical, like, I'm going to get you. I'm going to start counting. 
Every dab is another opportunity for an ass whooping. Um, my ass was never whooped. And uh, currently, from what I can tell, uh, it was too high to count. I have dabbed many times since the year 2019. Oh, I can't get in there. Oh, I can't get to the little kitty. What do I do, what do, I do about that? Maybe these flowers have something to do with it? Let's paint the land first. Maybe that'll work. I'm painting the apples red. I'm painting the apples red. That's what I'm trying to do, at least. Make a nice little green. All the plants gonna be red over here. It's gonna be beautiful. A little bit of that. I don't know how I'm supposed to get across that, to be honest. I don't know what to do. I don't know what I'm gonna do about it. What do I do? Make these tree trunks a nice yellow color. I like that. Oh, it's so beautiful. Hey, you know what? A little bit of spotting. A little bit of spotting around. I like that. That brings me joy. That doth spark joy to me. And then, uh, I don't know, maybe that, will that do anything? Oh, it's not gonna spread to everything else. Unless, if I do this, it'll spread to the coast, right? Mm. No. Oh, well. That's okay, then. Well, I guess I'll come for, back for you, kid, another time. Maybe if I go all the way around... Can I go all the way around the water? Hmm. Barley, do you have anything else to tell me? No, you don't. Unfortunately. You're still scared. You... There you go. Don't be scared. Now your red is blood. What? Oh, okay. Oh. I wonder, can I, like, bounce on top of it? Oh, maybe not. Is that not the way I thought it would work? No. What about this thing? Whoa! Well, would you look at that? It pushes you. That's pretty cool. And there's litter. I see the litter. I got a cute dress. Nice. I'll wear that for now. It's cute and it's dressy. Letter. I've got a litter to read. Now that I know that I can, like, paint the world like this, I don't know if I want to proceed without painting things at least somehow pleasing in a way i got a little bit of a like i sometimes feel like i gotta do things just right i'm a little bit of a attention to detail kind of person which i guess seemed pretty ironic because in the beginning like i was not paying attention to detail at all but it just seemed like it was almost in too inconvenient to be able to do things like in an easy manner that's not the case i have learned more now i know that there are plenty of ways to it's not like you have to just stroke the entire screen you can just click and hold and you can fill the whole thing up i was wondering if there was like a a bucket tool equivalent in this game what is this thing it's blocking the way to the temple and there's something scurrying in this rock over here Ugh! must be some more wielder stuff i guess i better ask some wielder about it but, but preferably not blackberry or chicory Hmm, I can't get around this thing. I wish I was a better climber. There must be someone out there who knows about it. Like, uh, Cardamom, I think, was the name of the wielder out here. AP Foothills and Eleven Seas this way. Eleven Seas. It's the Foothills. Bounce me. Nice. Nice bounce. Bounce me again. Nice bounce. And it's pretty cool. I wonder if that'll ever, like, paint a picture if I do it enough. Ooh. Get me over here, and then that'll push me over there. I'm gonna get up on that ledge. How does Don get up onto edge? I must go up the edge. Let's go this way. That pushes me over there. I see you scurrying over here. Child. You are safe now. I have collected you, lost child, and you do not need to be afraid anymore. For I am here to bring color back to the world as the new wielder. Do you feel safe, child? Do you feel safe in the arms of the wielder? No! Unfortunate. Oh, another flower. Cute. I love it. So I can go up there too. Nope, I went over there. Which way does that go? Oh, it shoots you that way. That one shoots you back down. I don't want to go back down yet. I'm going to see what else this other ledge has to offer. Oh, now I'm up here. All right, all right. <gasps> do, 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 do. That was pretty hot. I still haven't figured out what to do with these vine things. What to do? What to do? What to do? I must have some, Maybe if I click and hold on this, maybe? Mm, maybe. Oh, it's blue now. I can just keep on exploding if I wanted to. Oh, 
I guess that doesn't really do it. Hmm. I want that special. I want that special thing. Eventually, I shall figure out the ways. Um, I don't see anything useful over here. I'm gonna go back. Doot, doot, doot. It's rather suspicious that there's a, an Amoogus around here. I wonder who could have put that there. Certainly not I. I would have never. I would never be so suspicious. So I can pick up litter. 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 Did I pick up that other piece of litter? I don't know if I did, to be honest. Are you going to push me to the right? Yeah, dude. Oh, but if I... Ah, I see. I have to come back down. And then I have to do it in just the right way. Backwards. There we go. Now I go for the gift. What kind of fashion I'm... Howdy! It's the howdy hat. How did the stars? I'll wear that now, and then what I need to do is put on the la 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 la. What do you call it? I got it. Nope. There we go. Where's the button? Map and camera collection. Collection. Bush style. Brush style. There's so many different styles. There's so many different things to collect. Howdy and the star. The big star gray. Big star shirt. Nice. Cool. I can go see that other person eventually when I go back. Not that I can right now. I don't believe I can. I mean, I have that backtrack pretty far. Eventually, eventually I will return to you, Oats, to get more stuff. The master of fashion awaits for me to check out with them. Do, 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 do. Oh, I see. I see what's going on here. I need to open these all up and then make my way down. There we go. Yeah! I'm getting the hang of this mushroom thing. I got... Hanyun. Put that away for now. Uh, Kidoki. Now I want to get to the other side, so I need to reset. Or I can just do it like that. Alright. I love how the sounds of the mushrooms poofing you off in one direction is reminiscent of like, it, it reminds me of like squirting from a paint bottle. Which also kind of sounds like a fart. Which also makes it doubly hilarious. So, I'm chill with it. Oh, I could do that. Oh, that's cool. Now I know that I can do that. Also, I have new colors. I like the fact that each area seems to have its own color palette. That's awesome. Ah, and I bet I use this little bubble thing to break up with the rocks. But how to move the... Oh, I can move this around. Oh, look at that. Hey, that's pretty cool. I heard a cat. Meow, 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 kitty cat. Hello. Hello, child. Child. Young child. How do you plead? Guilty? Meow. Take him in, folks. He's going to jail. This kid's going to jail. Now that I know, I figured you could use, you could break the rocks with the power of this bubble thing. <gasps> Letter in the rocks. And something else over here. Now it's up here. Where does this send you? Goes you back down. I'm gonna go up this way. Hey, another puzzle with a big treasure. I'm gonna color in this area first, just so it makes the journey oh that much sweeter. Oh, the journeys that we will have together with this paintbrush in our hand, trying to figure out the wonders of the universe. I wonder if the oh, it's making a mess. It's making an absolute mess. I say. I can't believe it. You know what? I'm not bothered by it. I like it. I've always been a chaotic kind of personality. I'm cool with this. Where does that send you? That sends you off there. And if it sends me off in this direction, then boop. And boop. Do it again. And we go over here. And now I get access to the big old chest. Triple exclamation points. What do we got? I got a brush style. What is it? It's like, it's the grid. That's what it is. It's the grid. It reminds me of, like, rules, regulations. It makes me think of order, not chaos. <sighs> order. This style lets you paint with a texture. Cool. I like that. Oh. That's cool. And I get to drag it. Oh, that's cool. Really? I gotta try that. If I... Oh, 
that is so cool. Awesome. The colors get more... Co I wonder if, as you get through, like, the rest of this game, you wind up getting so much customizability with your brush that you can paint like the other wielders did. That'd be so cool. Awesome. There's so much possibility. There's so many colors that they're so possible here. Man. I like this. This is very cool. Like, I remember seeing this game for the first time and thinking like, you know what? It's colorful. I, I like that. I'm cool with that. Hmm. I just noticed that my stream software over here is flickering. I don't like the fact that the, I don't like the fact that it's flickering. Hopefully, it doesn't do that too much more often. I don't like that. Can I go that? What, what was going? Oh, it's right this one. If that becomes a pro, if I keep seeing that, I'm gonna do something about it. I don't know what I can do about it. I'm working with very limited hardware here. Okay, so now if I get down there to oh, what is oh, hello, what is this? Oh. Secret gift! The hot neck. Turtleneck? Hot neck. It makes your neck feel hot. I feel that. Put it away. Put that thing back where it came from. Or oh, so help me. So help me, so help me. Where else do the colors lead? So now I can go on, I guess, on the regular path. Oh, explosion. It's a good thing the ball doesn't, like, hurt you. I couldn't possibly be hurt by the color. The color? The color doesn't hurt me. Oh, I had the heart on. The heart on. Why do your colors now look sad? You're telling me that this looks sad? I think it's because I'm in a different area, but like, I think this looks pretty cool. It's a different dynamic. But I can do this now. Watch this, dear. This is cool. I can make a pattern with the grid and the polka dots. That is so cool. I am completely enthralled by that. That is awesome. All right, I gotta get around you. How do I get around you? Oh, I explode it. Oh, it knocks me off. Uh -huh -huh -huh. Well, I can put it over here and start far enough away from it such that I can push it from the other side, right? There we go. I'm a puzzle master and a painter, but mostly a puzzle master, but also mostly a painter. I don't know. Am I more artist than I am puzzle master? I don't know. Or perhaps we're a little bit of both. Maybe we don't need to buy into the dichotomy of painter and puzzle master. Why can't we all just be who we want to be? Barbie girl. Be who you want to be, Barbie girl. What's up, chard? That's a food. Pretty sure that's a vegetable. <laughs> Oh, I'm not waking this kid up. That's fine. What if I explode that thing above him? What if I push? I explode you. If I explode you. Oh, litter. Nice. That was litter. That's bad. Litter's bad, kids. Okay. Oh, I didn't mean to do it that way, but I like that. Oh, look at that. I can do it like this. The different levels also respond differently to the thingamabob. That is really, really cool. So if I do that thing from there, will it explode him? Wake him up? Okay, that didn't wake you up. So a bomb won't wake you up. What will? Maybe if I put it right next to your face. Like this. Come on, Chard. I'm gonna wake you up. I'm gonna call it do something devilish. I'm gonna blow you up. Just like this. A ticking time bomb. Here we go. Here it comes, Chard. Beware. You've got a bomb next to you. I didn't wake you up. Oh, you know what? I wonder if I can run on top of the ball. If I bring the ball down there, can I use it to get across? Hmm. Now that feels like an idea. Now it may not be anything more than just an idea, but it feels all right to me. I'm cool with that. All right, if I put ball here, put ball, put ball right here. Put the ball here, go around. On top of ball? Can I? Oh, I can't go on top of ball. Hmm. 
What if, I know the ball kind of blew me away the one time, what if I go into this little area here and I use the ball to push me up onto a particular area? Like, like this. And then I explode it. Uh, maybe? Hello? Nah, that didn't really work. Interesting. Oh, no, 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 I should put the ball over here and then push it down and push myself over like this, right? Yes. This is the way to do. And I got the big heart. You've got a big heart. Nice. Liking that. I'm gonna paint that stuff up there. Well, now... Oh, and I can use this to push myself back across. Like this. Nice. And I need the ball down here anyway, because I need to I need to break those those rocks. Oh, okay. I might have ruined it. I've ruined the fun for everybody. Clumsy me. But I take it down here and nope, I want it I don't want it in the corner. Please, no corner. Buddy. Cheese Mac? Sushi Mac? Sushi Mac, please. There we go. I just noticed how wonderful the, the name selection was. Like, what's your favorite food? Everybody's named after food. So, like, now you're also named after food. They're railroading you to conform. Bam, look at that. Ooh, thank goodness. My, my sister's on the other side of those rocks. I was thinking about how to clear them. So hard that, well, I probably appear to be sleeping. Looks like it worked. Ha <laughs> I've got to get back to her right away. Bye, Chard. Bye, Bye, Chard. Hey, look. Oh, the 11 C's. Licorice and Chard. Nice. You're the one who cleared the rocks? Thank you. We were completely trapped here. And I was so hungry. I get very cranky when I miss my meals. Swear to God, if you take away my Twizzler, which is a type of licorice, if you take my Twizzies away from me, I will mess you up. It's true. She really does. Thanks also for helping my lazy, good-for-nothing brother. When the rocks came down, I worried about him. I should have guessed he'd just be asleep. I told you I was thinking of how to get around them. Basically had it all figured out when this person arrived. Yeah, nobody's buying that. I've never heard of rock slides around here. It's been enough excitement for me. I've got to take a nap. Oh, that's a lovely idea. Not you. You make me food. That's what you get for scaring me. Ellipsis. Well, alrighty then. Can I make you po uh, sp spotted? Can I do that? I don't think I can make you spotted. No, I can't give you, uh, I can't give you that. I thought maybe I'd be able to give him, like, chicken pox, I guess, would be the equivalent if I put a bunch of polka dots on you. Anchot and Olive. We can't play in the foothills because of the stupid rocks. I'm so bored. Hey, wait a sec. You are from here. Does that mean the rocks are cleared? We're saved. So you're the wheel to right? Wow. Can you do color in something? Who's, ta who's talking? It's nice. I can actually move this around to see who's talking if I can't, if not already obvious. No, just do something. Everything. This whole screen. Ah, do it, do it, do it. Watch this, dude. Red colors activate. Uh, actually, instead of the pattern, red colors activate. Let's go. Uh, do the whole thing. All right. It's going to take more than just the power of clicking and holding a button to do this. Okay, I'm bored. Yeah, that's enough. Ellipses. Do you want some trash we found? Trash they found has been obtained. I love it when I get trash from kids. I love playing in the foothills. I like the bubbles that come up from the ground. Yeah, that way they explode. My mom says they're full of gas. <laughs> Who's talking? If you go up from the mountain, something will happen. Sometimes they spill. Fuss. I love you, kids. You're so bombastic. I vibe with your energy. Ooh. Is there more, there like, little holes over there? Does that have something to do with the darkness? Whoa! They are geysers! They were absolutely right about geysers. They just keep on going, and then they just kind of go back down. Well, that's pretty cool. 
Oh, I can't go over that way. I think there's trash over there. <gasps> trash. I'm Bonnie's trash. Dessert Mountain. Hey, litter. Nice. What am I going to do with litter? I will definitely find some use for litter eventually. So I'll pick up as much as I can. That or it's just totally optional. In which case, eh, cool. Man, I like this vibe. Man, that is a vibe. I totally feel that. I'm gonna try to make the river as blue as I possibly can over here. As well as up here. I like that. I like that. But the sides of the river should be a nice blue. I wonder if after I'm done with the next wielder, I'll have the power to paint the waters. Oh wait, I don't even get over there. Oh, I can't get over there from here. Gotta go back. I am definitely not very completionist. I will walk around and do some areas and then completely leave others for whatever reason. Hello down there. Jaffel, did you clear out the rocks outside town? Thank you. My husband, Couscous, is still a potluck. No one here, he's paralyzed with panic right now. If you see him, you should let him know we're okay. This mountain region is a bit unstable. Volcanic gas bubbles tend to come up to the surface. They can pack quite a pop when they burst. Naturally, kids here love playing with them. I've learned to let them do what they will. Marzipan! Ah, oh, the wielder. Maybe you can help me. I'm the proprietor of this art gallery. But all of your uh, paintings lost their color! So much history and all a tragedy! I'm hoping to reach the Potluck Art Academy. They're in charge of official art preservation. Please visit there and help us refill the gallery. I'll try. You'll be red, you'll also be red, and then you'll also be yellow, and you will also be yellow. Ah, the dichotomy of colors. Call home. Call home and get a hint on what to do next? Like, I, if I, I don't want a hint, but like, I'd love to call my parents. I'm gonna call my parents anyway. Um, hello? It's me, Mom. Oh, Sushi and Mac, is everything okay? I explain my whole situation. Hmm, <laughs> that does sound tricky. Well, if you're asking me, I, Cardamom and Elder and C should be able to help you. You must be very close by. Okay, sweetie? Okay, Mom. It's always good to hear from you, Sushi and Mac. Your sister says hi, by the way. No, oh, I have a sister. That's so cool. News to me. I never knew my sister. Hey, kitty cat, get out of there. Get out of there, kitty cat, little child. I will find all the children. Maybe. Oh, this is the... Okay. This is the art gallery. So... Oh, I wonder if I go out and paint all those other paintings that are just kind of strewn about, if I will be able to come in here and and then I'll, I'll see the paintings here. I feel like that's... I feel that that's it. I feel in my brain that that must be it. I feel a strange urge to paint this area. So I'm going to do that. Every so often I get that. Cameron draw draw dog. Is that a particular character? You know what? Before I get that answer, I'm gonna draw my interpretation of what I believe draw dog done good be. So draw dog is the main character. We're gonna give him a little bit of a little thing over here. Get that. Get that up there. Gotta make sure the hat. Pop it back down. Which color shall I use for the the, the dark? I think. This gray, this green color will be beautiful. I like that. I like that. I'm going to take a little bit away, actually. Give it, give the nose a little shine. Just a little bit of a shine. Don't forget the eyes. More eyes. There are two eyes. Cameron, eyes, please. There we go. Back to the blue for the ears. I like to think that the ears actually kind of look like, like, duck feet. That's, that's what I'm getting. They kind of look like web feet. I like that. That's a little sharp, but I'm okay with that. Let's do the hat as this color. I'm gonna be pretty uh, pretty bad with these curves, so bear with me. There we go. Then I'm gonna go up. I'm gonna do a little curve, the cowboy hat. Gonna bring it back around. Cowboy time. Howdy there, folks. Howdy. I'm gonna try. Oh, you know what? If I if I go across like this, and then I switch to the pattern, the pattern, that kind of gets that, that, like, 
and not what I was going for, but I'm cool with it. I'm cool with it. And yeah. Oh, but also don't forget the dress. I'll do the clothing in a different in that same color as the hat. Coming on down. With the, whoops, I'm still with the pattern. Did not mean to do that. That's okay. Happy little accidents. As they as as people would say. With the dress around here. Let's do the blue. Oh, come on. Keep your pose there, draw dog. Sushi dog. Sushi Mac. Sushi Mac. Sushi back! Wielding a paintbrush! I think the star should be the same color as your nose. Or I could just use the star stroke. I really could have done that, but you know what? Hmm. Do -do 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 -do. Back to the blue for the legs. Just little, just little hot dogs. The legs are just little hot dogs, little popsicles. That one's a little chubby, but that's okay. Okay, and now you need a paintbrush. And you wield that paintbrush. I feel that the, the green color fits best. So you got the little paintbrush in the back. Wield it down there. And the paintbrush. Yeah. And that's my art dog. That's my draw dog. That's my impression of draw dog. The prompt was draw dog. Draw dog. You know what? I can actually, I can do the picture. I'm going to do that. I like that. Yes. Raw dog. Whoa. No. <laughs> draw dog. Draw dog. Don't. That was. That was weird. Draw dog in her purest form. Picture. Now I can mess with this a little bit. Oh, wait. I want to see inverted again. That's cool. I want to see the inverted colors. Eh. I'm cool with it. I like that. That's another picture I think I'll take with that. Perfect. Sometimes you just gotta stop and smell the roses. Or the acrylic paints. Stop and smell your paints. And your glue. And your permanent Sharpie markers. Or don't. At least not too much. Everything in moderation. Let's go see- Oh wait, 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 Marzipan, I had to talk to you. Again? Today hasn't been great! Seeing the gallery art without color is heartbreaking! Maybe I panicked too much when I took it all down. But I couldn't stand leaving it up in black and white. It's not, na it's not how it was meant to be seen. Well, now it's better. I spoke with Cardamom about it since, you know, he was once a wielder. But it's no use. Only the brush can make new color. And the Art Academy is the only official leader of art preservation. We can't do anything without going through them. Ah, so frustrating! You've got to visit the Art Academy as soon as you can. D is this... Okay, this is not the Art Academy then. Wait, but I was, I was already at the Art Academy. Oh, I guess I'll go back and visit them eventually. Oh, you can still talk. You can still talk, Marzipan. You still have more things to say. You don't have anything else to say, but you do. I hope the Art Academy can help us soon. With all the missing art, it's like Star has gone out. Oh, That's sad. That's metaphorical. And even not. What if a star does go out? If our star goes out, we'll all freeze to death. And that's no good. What's up, Cardamom? Oh, you are awesome looking. I like you. You're the new wielder everyone's talking about. I'm caught a mom. I used to be the wielder too. Did you come investigate in the wielder temple? Oh yeah, I did. Do you know anything about that? I knew. Lots of things. Why don't you come inside? All right, Carter mom. Carter mom gives me a very red vibe. I'm gonna paint this dude's house. All right, as red as I possibly can. So the red's gonna be orange. Interesting how it only got port pieces of the floor. Well, your floor, I think, should be blue. A nice blue floor. I feel that. Nice. I like that. And then bombastic colors like that for most of your furniture. Your wall gets to be that green color. Yeah. Like that. But then, of course, the yellow comes back. Uh, the yellow. The yellow? Okay, that one comes back. There we go. Oh, like, inside it is a different color palette than outside blue pants blue pants cardamom so i'll show you the way to the, into the temple but are you sure you're ready for it it's just those spooky trees right i can totally take care of that i've dealt with literal elder horrors. just it's the worst i've ever seen you've seen them before i don't want to scare you but there's something which lurks deep down below 
And when it rises up, the only thing that can fight it is the brush. What? What's the thing? Oh, you know, it was a movie about this slime that could take over people's bodies and eventually kill them and perfectly copy their every bit of personality. It's a horror film. You really wouldn't be into it. In ancient evil, the thing. Or something like that, probably. Chicory didn't tell you? I'm sorry. Regular folks aren't supposed to know about this. It's something you take on when you become the wielder. But it's too much for you. I can do it! I can! I can do it! Chicory entrusted this to me! She told me, yeah, you can take the brush. I don't want to let everyone down, especially not Chicory, my favorite artist of all time. Okay. I was scared for a second there. Here it is. Here, what it? Whoa! Okay! Nice. Paint that symbol on the door. You might want to take a photo of it to remember. You've got one of those fancy camera maps, right? Okay. Good luck. Thanks, Carter Mom. You're so much nicer than I expected. Oh? Really? The other wielders I've met have been... Intense. Like that circus fire. <laughs> it was intense. Mm. Oh. <laughs> I was the wielder a long time ago now. So I've had time to recover. I've mellowed out with my age. I just take things as they come. How was wielding been for you? Are you managing okay? I guess so. I feel like I don't know what I'm doing. Haha. <laughs> That's normal. Nobody knows what they're doing. How long were you the wielder for? Oh, let me think. Must have been nine or ten years. Wow! It's grueling work. But you know it isn't much compared to my successor, Blackberry. She was the wielder. Oh, she, she was the wielder for my whole life. Until Chicory. Blackberry really devoted herself to it. Thought she'd take the brush to the grave. So for her to finally choose a successor, nobody ever deserved it more than Chicory. How did you know you were done wielding? I stopped when I felt like I couldn't anymore. Actually, it's just when I started looking for a successor. So I was still wielding for a while after that. I was horrible. Sometimes you don't notice how terrible things is something is till it's over. But life's much easier now. You didn't like being a wielder? I liked it okay. Well, what I really like is drawing. That always makes me feel good. But when you become the wielder, you aren't drawing for yourself anymore. You draw for everyone. And I wanted to make everyone happy. So, sometimes that was hard. Oh, I feel that, buddy. So I need the circle with the thing in the center. Got it. I'm gonna commit that to memory. I got it. It's the circle with the little thing up from the bottom. Center down, circle. I got it. Let's make our way back to the door. Somewhere over here. Oh, I forgot to give the children some color. You seem red like your parents. If you have parents. Do you have parents? You may not have parents. You know what? Let's not bring up the idea of parents because if they don't have parents, then that's awkward, especially for the children. Back to the Appy, Appy, Appy Foothills? Appy, 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 Woo! I like this vibe here. Wait, how do I get back to- Oh, I gotta go to the other one. Gotta go to the other mushroom. Down we go. And uh, make my way over here. Don't need no mushrooms anymore. Gotta come down here. I need to go- to the door? Was the door over here? I thought it was. Somewhere over here, maybe? Uvar here? Yes, to the door. So I can get real small with that. So, I need the circle. Circle. The power of the wielder. The wielder or what? The wielder of the brush, silly. There we go. And I need to paint it like that. And that was pretty cool. 
Now I can pass through it. It's like ethereal now. Nice. Welcome to the cooler side of the block. Nice. Oh, hello. Phone call. Cardamom, maybe? H hello? I don't remember what your voice was. Hey. Sushi and Mac. Oh, it's chicory. That's chicory. I honestly thought that was blackberry. Whoops! Can I draw you? Yes, I can draw you! Nice. Can I draw on the little phone line? I can't draw the phone line. Unfortunate. <laughs> how, how did you know I was here? I can see you with my telescope. I wanted to say... Uh, sorry about the way that I acted before. I was just feeling super depressed. Oh, th that's okay. D do you mean you're feeling better? You want the brush back? Oh, no way. <laughs> I'm pretty done with that. Chicory, you are my favorite wielder ever. It makes me sad that you'd quit. Ellipses. Aren't you excited to be wielding now? Well, I don't know. Are you really sure it should be me? I think you're better for it than I was. For really? <laughs> yeah, you're so enthusiastic. Just, I just don't have that spark. But, but, how could that be true? Your art was always so... Bold. Colorful. And strong. Everything I wish I could be. You can be those things. I believe in you, Sushi and Mac. I love that. Just call me Sushi for sure. And I can't do it myself anymore anyway. I really need your help. Is, is that okay? Can you keep trying? Oh, of course! I'll... I'll do my best! Okay. Thanks, Sushi Mac. No, 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 no. Thank you, Chicory. You're the bomb diggity, Chicory. Yeah. <laughs> Talk to you. Talk to you later. Man, you're so cool. Oh my god, you're so cool. Phone call! Man, you're so cool. Oh my god, you're so cool. Canvas number three. The Potluck Art Academy is in charge of these. I could go there sometime and fill this in. Confusion. So this looks to be a different pattern. I'm guessing it's whatever pattern... I'd say whatever the pattern is, is exactly this one here. Let's see. Boop. And boop doop. Boop. And doop doop. Wow. Nice. Nice, nice, nice. Let's head on up there. Uh, but first, I want to make this whole area nice. Uh, this one. Yellow. Yeah. It's a nice yellow color. Cool. I like the way that looks now. The Wielder Temple creates beauty. What is beauty? I don't know. Oh, 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 look at that. Reveal the truth. Yo, I see what's happening here. That's pretty cool. So if I color, seek the nature of the brush. I need to find the code to that door. Oh, you know what? But I wonder, I should color everything. If I don't color everything, I might miss something. Perhaps in the walls. That's pretty cool. I really like that. Let's see. I'll try a different color scheme over here. A darker one. It's kind of spooky in here. I'll sit down while I paint. I can just relax and paint, you know? Just sit down here and just... Chillax. Chillax as I paint some of the corners over here. Honestly, painting is something I definitely really want to do again. I think the last time... The last time that I painted... I painted something out of anger. I was very, very angry at things, and so I decided to paint a little bit, and I de like I felt a lot better after it. It's nice sometimes to be able to use creative outlets to kind of vent those frustrations out of you. You know? I don't know. Maybe I don't know. To each their own, I suppose. I feel like I used to be pretty violent as a young child. Didn't have enough, uh, didn't have enough creative hobbies to do. So, uh, and then I started drawing and stuff like that. Oh, I don't think I should have done that. Oh, I guess it doesn't matter. I just want to fill in that wall. There might be secrets in the wall. 
Cool, cool. What's on the ground? I bet I can explode that thing. Uncover what goes unseen. Like the triangle that's in the right corner of the room. Doo -doo -doo -doo. Doo -doo 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 -doo. Nice, nice, nice. Get on up there and explode it. Nice. The very generic streamer speedruns this game. Seeing that room in color is mind-blowing. Oh, I can understand. Because I suppose if you don't need to color it in... Like these areas, I guess if you already know what the uh, if you already know what the messages are in the room, then you don't need to color it at all. That's a very interesting point. About how long does it take for you to speed run the game? I think I remember seeing uh, at least on the description for this that they said there was at least ten plus hours of content. I am very slow with the games that I play, so there's probably like twenty hours worth of content at least for me, because I'm just I'm slow at what it is that I do. However, I very much enjoy it. I bet there's also a thing over there, right? Like, most definitely that arrow is pointing to another crack in the wall. All we are is just a, another crack in the wall. Nice. Nice. A black tea. Should I wear it now or put it away? I'm gonna put it away. I'm still repping this awesome Howdy Star-Lord thing. Okay. So uncover the nature of the brush. 29 minutes world record. Dude, nice! It could take 29 minutes to get through this? That seems crazy to me. Wow. But I suppose if you skipped all the dialogue and you didn't talk to anybody, then I guess it'd be pretty easy to kind of get through. I would assume so. Unless it's like a 100... I guess it's not 100% all collectibles and whatnot. I feel like that would take more time. Unless, if it is, then that is even more incredible than I thought. In which case, I applaud for you. That's incredible. I don't think I can ever do things like that. Although, 100% would be 2 hours and 35 minutes. That is so cool. It must take a lot of dedication to speedrun. I, I have a very special place in, like, my my heart and my appreciation for speedrunners. Because, like, I feel like I'm the kind of person who can sit there for hours playing a game. But not over and over again. I feel like doing that, the same thing over and over again to try to get, like, better at it is something that I just can't do. But to know that there are people out there who can is... It's incredible. And I've never been the kind of person to, like, watch speedrunners, but, like, everyone said... There was this one class that I was in where the person in front of me always was watching so many speedrunning, like, old Mario games or whatnot, and Smash... Uh, uh, not Smash Brothers. I don't think you speedrun Smash Brothers. Maybe you did. Anyway, whatever it was. But I'd always be looking over and being like... I wonder how wonder what game they're playing. What how fast are they doing it? Because I am very curious on it how like like the culture of the speedrunner. Especially in like I'm also a bit of a tech guy. So especially in like the older video games where you can exploit glitches, especially glitches that come about because like because like of the hardware that it's running on. I'm really entertained by stuff like that. Like, you, you overflow a buffer or something on your Game Boy Advance, and now you can re or you go to a particular place in Pokemon, and you could just reprogram the entire game into Tetris. Like, that is so cool! Or you can go to, um, whatever you do, like, in one of the Super Mario World games, you can essentially overflow uh, a register in the hardware, or whatever the software equivalent of it would be, and then it goes back, and you just win the game immediately. Stuff like that is just mind-blowing. A tree. It grew from below with colorful fruit. And deep roots. Oh. These the roots of the trees. Or um, I think there was another there was another instance of a spontaneous glitch happening, allowing for a world record in a video game was I think what they were saying was it was Super Mario 64, and what had happened was random cosmic background radiation caused a single bit to change, allowing like a few minutes to be knocked off of the world record. And I was like, that doesn't sound right to me. However, cool. I guess. I don't know. But if that actually did happen, then that is absolutely cool. I don't know if I believe it. Pow, just like that. And walk on through. Seek the nature of the brush. I will seek the nature of the brush. Any more secrets in here? More mysteries to be found. What can we find? Yes. Or nothing. I could just sit here 
and chillax. Just paint the room around. I, I realize now, I think sitting around is, I think the purpose of that would be like to just kind of focus on the painting. You could just sit there as your character sits and do whatever it is that you do. It's lovely. Absolutely lovely. Any more messages in here? A lot of fruits, a lot of fruits I like that. Oh, want to go back downstairs, please? Thank you. Color the room. Speed running is like a fun thing to see on how someone may do this over and over. The other person doing that, it's much, very fun to look at. Yeah, I think it's really cool to kind of see like the amount of, I feel like it's almost like watching, I guess, I guess somebody, honestly, anybody doing anything that they're really, really passionate about has like a certain splendor to it. Cause like, I mean, you gotta be, you gotta be really, really into it, into a game to speed run it, I think. That or like your profession is like speedrunner, in which case it's all part of a job. But even still, like you gotta you gotta marvel at somebody's skill because of the experience that they had to be able to speedrun that much, I imagine. But it, it's cool to be able to watch that stuff. I don't like I said, I don't really watch it myself. But that's just because I just never have that stuff up in the background. Uh, I'm usually watching like TV shows in the background. But I've been trying to do a bit more, especially with now that you know, now that I myself am a Twitch streamer trying to tune into other people's Twitch streams as well, in the back, at least in the background, so I can have something to listen to, something to glance over at, and another person to support along the way, because we're all just trying to get through this together, I think. I think. Some people feel that way. That's how I feel about it. Love will bring this world together. Love, or maybe not just love, but like support and stuff like that. We alter our perspective in search of butts. Teehee. Oh, if I sit here, then something happens. Maybe. What perspective may you be thinking of? Maybe I search everything in the round. Oh, look at that. It's a backward C. But, what's a but? Well, you see, B-U-T-T -T is actually an acronym. Probably. And the acronym stands for Between Under Two Televisions. Between, uh, between Under two televisions. So if there are two televisions, imagine for a moment, two televisions. Between them and underneath is us. That is butts. Which I think some would say is the truth. Oh, I see that. Sometimes the path word lies behind. Haha, <laughs> get it? Because because butts, butts, uh, between under two televisions. Because uh, old televisions, CRT, uh, they used to be CRTs, cathode ray tubes, they had big behinds to them so that's why the behind about the b-u-t-t-s's the b-u-t-t's is is so funny because of the televisions because they've got big butts so if i instead do it the other way oh i didn't have to do that there we go alter your perspective give it a little switch come on over here i feel like can i go in here nah i don't think so i don't see any explody balls to use what about if I... What if I do this? And do it like this. And then I alter my perspective again and come on all the way back. Puzzle games. Yeah. What's in here? I'm descending deeper into the wielder temple. Spooky. Am I going to get a telephone call down here? Who has this number? Mom? Call home? No? All right. Well, I don't need to call home. Unless... I hope it's getting scarier. Ooh, it's getting scary. I think. At least I see the darkness catching up on me. In the pursuit of beauty, we seek... We seek connection in every direction. Better question. Why is there a telephone? Right? Why is there even a telephone down here? Well, I suppose if this is the wielder temple... Maybe the wielder spends a lot of time down here, and maybe they want to call home, too. We, we shouldn't restrict the wielder to not be able to call their home. That's just so mean. We seek direct connection in every direction. That's so cute. Hmm. I wonder what that means. If I color this room, perhaps I'll find out. Connection to the... I don't, I can't, I don't know what that reads. Solumna? Soluma? Solution? Soluma. But, B-U-T-T, -T, between under two televisions. This is a sacred place. Please stop desecrating it. 
Connection to others. Connection to nature. Do I get to, like, choose? Hmm. What more secrets are there to find? Connection to the self. There, I feel like there's a lot of metaphors going on here. Like, what is the connection to the self? What is art? Does it really review, reveal something about yourself? This seems to have been a very common thing on my mind this week. The whole... An artist's art really speaks about their own inner truth. But what is that inner truth? Does it have form? Is it more abstract? Is it colorful? Is it perhaps an absence of color? Oh. The music just got epic for a moment there. That was pretty cool. Now it's got a really epic guitar. They're like really, they're like plucking the big guitar string. So it's like, that's the boing sound. That is awesome. It's so cool. Oh my god. I love it! So I can go in here and. Whoa. Well, hi there. I thought I could do stuff under the, under the ground. Oh, I can paint. Yep, I can. Sweet. So drawing funny dogs, doing funny things, says something deep? I think so. What if by dog. We mean that we're actually all dogs in our own right. A dog is in somebody like, oh, you're such a dog. Like, perhaps the dog in us all is telling us that we will all simp around for the things that we want. Like, uh, I, I don't really know. What does it mean to be a dog again? Like, oh, you're such a dog. Like, you're always going after people. Or you're always... Yeah, maybe you're always going after people. Maybe that's what it means to be a dog. I don't, I don't really remember. But maybe that's what it means. Perhaps the animal motifs tell us more about ourselves. Or maybe it's just, maybe it's just cool. Oh, a gift. I got a wielder cloak. That's cool. Oh, this is Blackberry's coat. Oh, that's so cool. Nice. And if I go into here, there's another area that I can explode. Right? Oh, maybe, maybe not. Oh, what is this? Can I actually... I don't think I can go up there. Oh, can I bring the ball inside? Can I bring ball inside? Can I play ball inside today? Can I play ball inside? Can I go ball inside? Ball inside. No? Okay. Guess not. Can't bring ball inside, so what done do? That brought me over to that area over there. There's probably another area to go to. Oh, duh. Look at this. I can just put it up here and break another hole in the wall, right? It's gotta be. Yes. Yes, absolutely. That had to be it. Oh, but I can't go over there. So I'm gonna go over here. No, that wasn't it. Oh, is there another hole in the wall? Right here, perhaps? Yeah, there totally was. Just break more holes in the wall. Nice. It's all about desecrate. I love how the, the one thing says, don't desecrate this place. I'm desecrating this place. I am literally blowing shit up. Like, not much more, not much more that I think I can do about not desecrating it. I am causing absolute turmoil here. I'm a vandalizer. I'm vandalizing the temple, but I'm the wielder, so I can do whatever I want, right? Obviously. Nice. And now, what do over here? Oh, I need to use... Uh, I need to go over here. Now that the rock is broken, I wrap up all the way around. I come around the side over here. Then I go into the exit and open up the box. A new pattern? I hope it's... Stripes! I really hope that there was a plaid pattern in this game. I am really hoping that there was a plaid pattern in this game. This style lets you paint with a texture. I like that. I like textures. I think I like textures more than stamps. I have always been a fan of textures like this so i'm going with it and i will celebrate by texturing the rest of this room with stripes oh but first actually ooh, without that i'm gonna do i'm gonna do a dark dark color first revealing whatever it is up there and then i'll do the stripes with like uh, that's fine nope stripes 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 I like that. That is really cool looking. 
a little difficult on the eyes from afar, but I'm liking that. That gives me good feelings. The good feelings, because I like stripes. Stripes are good. So, I have that now. So what else can I cover perhaps in this direction? The first wielder. Was, was good at what they do, maybe? I don't know. Or maybe this is going to be something terrible. Had a huge butt. This is not okay. <laughs> first wielder had a huge butt. Tee hee. Had a huge... What was, it called? What, did it, what was it again? What does butt stand for? Between, under, two televisions. Oh, and that B-U-T-T -T was ginormous. Absolutely ginormous. So what I can do is I can paint in this thing a particular direction to open up the next area. I just paint an arrow. Huh, that's pretty simple. I feel like I could have figured that out on my own. Ta-da! All this litter down here. It's terrible. How could you desecrate this place like that? How dare you? Connection to the sublime. What's your connection to the sublime? I don't know. Well, I guess this middle area here can... Yeah, whatever. Depending on which direction I want to go next. Connection in nature is this way. We nurture nature, all grown to the bad, all bow to the something potential. Oh, look at that down there. Huh. We nurture nature so all are grown to their full potential. Aw, isn't that sweet? Big question. Chicken sandwich or turkey sandwich? Okay, if it's fried, I'm going with chicken sandwich. If it's grilled, I go turkey sandwich. I say that because I love Chick-fil-A sandwich. Those ones are nice and crispy. I like the crispy chicken sandwiches. However, if it's turkey, I feel like I wouldn't be the same way about a crispy turkey sandwich. I don't know. I've never tried it. But that's, uh, that's my answer. That's my final answer. I think I feel that way. I like that. This seems to show an upper part of oh this is a this is a portion of the thingy. Oh, and I need this to be like that so I can bounce along out of there. I bounce and then I bounce and then I just go this way and collect the gift. Yes. Smock. Nice. Oh, hello. Bouncing around <laughs> bouncing around, bouncing around, bouncing around, bouncing, bouncing around. So this over here seems to imply that the top three either the top three or this is in that direction i'm gonna take a picture of that or you know what I'll, I'll write it down that's what i'll do i will write that down in the leftmost area i'll do that as purple i have that little triangle in the corner there we go uh and there's two more it's a six by three. That's what we have in that direction. Let's move to another perspective. Something more exciting, or not. Like down below. What can lurk down below in these areas to the southernmost areas? Sometimes a little change of perspective is all you need. Oh, now I can go all nice and glowy. Reveal to me the way. We cast lights in our deepest darkness. Oh, if I just color this one, then it'll be just fine. Oh, look at that. Okie dokie. Okie dokie, artichokey. Let me grab another post-it note. So I can mark down this one, too. I'll mark this one in gray. Down is gray. And that is... It's six by six, it looks like. Six by six. And at the bottom, it is open, open, Closed, 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 open, open, and then nothing, closed, open, open, closed, nothing, and then closed, closed, in the middle. Nothing, nothing, closed, closed, no, nothing, nothing. What do we got down there? So now, I wonder what kind of colors lay around the border. Anything at all, or just, just the walls? It's probably just the walls, but, you know, maybe there's something lurking in the darkness. Hollywood superstar Shia LaBeouf. Was there anything to find over here? I don't think so. Or over here. Oh, this thing is like... Oh, it was pulsating because I had my paintbrush over it. I understand now. 
I think I completely understand. This is how the wielder do. Come on through, wielder boo. What do you find? What kind of truths will I find over here? Once I paint the floor all this interesting dark grayish. Over that way, okay. Where do you go? You go that way. You go that way. I'll pick up trash. 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 Found trash. Do -do 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 Oh, where do you go? You go that way. I want you to go over there. Who gets me up there? That sends me way over there. That would send me where I want to be. Right here. Yes! And then... Yes! And then... Well, then I move on. We follow the path to others' heart, but this is pathetic. It isn't funny. I, I, you know, I'm getting a small kick out of it, so I can't really agree with either sentiment. To that side was... I'm writing that down. Taking a thing of it. I could just take a picture of it with my phone, but this is an artsy game, so I'm gonna write it down on paper. Got it. Okie dokie. I think I have everything I need to reconstruct the thingy. Maybe? Perhaps? Perchance? Perchance I did. Or maybe there's more. Maybe there's more that meets the eye. Oh, it's time to work that body, doing some cross-side crunches. My fiance makes sure that I get up and move. That I get up and move every once in a while, so I'm gonna do that. Ugh. Actually, that feels pretty good right about now. I'm getting hot. I'm getting like really toasty in here. I wonder if my fiance turned off the air conditioner. Because if she did, that'd make me sad. Make me very sad. Oh, it feels good to get up and move. You know, micro breaks are a thing, but I don't really do micro breaks. It's not something that I do. I should put down micro-breaks? What do you mean? Tell me more, dearest. You're the PT lady. It's only 80 in here. It's only 80? It's only 80 degrees? Oh, dear me. It must not be very hot. Usually I'm okay with the warmth. However, when I have headphones on, for some reason I always feel a little... Put it at 79. It is now at 79. Thank you, dearest. She's awesome. Okie dokie, so I have three different areas, so I just need to paint them the way that I'm supposed to. The bottom area was this, that, 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 and this, this. Nice. That's the that's the answer for that one. This one is a little bit of boop, boop. It's like a it's like a downwards rocket ship. And then the other one was a different color. It's the three corners. And then this one, I think. No. Oh, did I? Hmm. Oh, no, no, this one. Nope. Oh. Oh, I need to go recheck that one again. Ooh. I did not transcribe it correctly. I have to go back and check again. So let's do that. Onward to that way. So I may correct my mistakes. Bad camera. So all are grown, are all are grown to their full potential. So all are grown to their full potential. Oh, I just noticed that the dots are all everywhere. Oh, I see, I see. I have to fill in the entire area. I have to fill in the whole darn thing. Yeah, because they can all grow. So I fill in the whole thing, right? That's That's my interpretation of that. I hope I'm correct. No, okay, it's only one of the one of the plants. All are grown to their full potential. We nurture nature, so all are grown to their full potential. Is there a particular one here? Oh, some of them mean the one and some of them mean the other. Okie dokie. So it's either a cross or the inverse of that. I'll eventually get it. I, I, I'll eventually get that. I'm gonna do reverse cross. So everything but the cross on the top. There we go. Nice! Puzzle Man strikes again. Nice. Onward to the next level. Until the next level. Or so. Oh, wow. It's going to get dark dead. Oh, it's spooky time. Feels like it's spooky time. Oh, it is pretty spooky down here. But let's fix that. Let's bring light to this area in the darkness. Yeah, there can't be anything that works too creepily in the darkness. Except spooky dooky trees. I wonder if the Vandalizer was not a wielder. I wonder if it was a monster. What if it's a monster that's been writing these butts everywhere? That's 
be nasty. Or maybe not so nasty at all. All right. And then I can do the rest with the green. As I walk on through the valley of yellow. What a wonderful concept for a game. I realized that. It's great. Oh, hello, big tree. Ah, you're a spooky tree and I can't draw you again. Oh, but there's a path that way. Path that way? Path that way. What's in the path this way? I can't go in yet. Oh. I can't go that way. Oh, huh. I don't know why. Maybe it's got something to do with my innermost truths. Or it's just not passable right now. That's fine, too. Yeah, you know what? I, I'm okay with that. Oh, that lit something up. Can I light the whole thing up? Yeah, maybe I'll find something. Mm, or maybe not. <laughs> okay, nope. Guess I'm going inside. Inside spooky tree. Oh, here we go again. Inverted colors. That must mean it's boss time. It's a giant eyeball. We're friends, right? Oh, there's two eyeballs. Okay. I'm prepared for this. Oh, okay. Oh, they both. They don't like being touched in the face with the paint. They're going to combine together. Does it have a nose now? Oh. That's actually not that. Holy shit. Okay. Oh my god, that's incredibly demonic. What are you doing? It's a demon bunny. Wait, but the only other bunny I know of is Chicory. Oh, Chicory, my my girl. Are you... You're not okay, are you? You're really not okay. It's okay to say that you're not fine, by the way. It's okay. It's okay to say that you're not fine, Chicory. Chicory. Is everything fine? I think everything's fine. Everything's not fine. Everything is most definitely not fine. But if I keep running for the lasers, I'll probably be okay. Ah, I just don't like how happily you bounce around like that. That is incredibly creepy. Spooky. Spookiness. That is a pretty brick. Holy jeez. Oh my god. No, I don't like that. Nope, nope. And you're spinning up in that direction. Oh dear god. If they like looking at you, that means they like you. They lo likes me very much, apparently. It really likes me. I don't know if I want it to like me, though. Oh my god, I can't. Oh, I have to go around here? Oh, to zoom out. I accidentally zoom. It's... Tongue? Tongue? What's with the tongue? Was that a tongue coming out of your head? Oh my god! This is disgust. Stop! No! I don't want it! Don't touch me! This is a really weird game of centipede. Oh, I keep zooming in by accident. I don't want to zoom in by accident. Stop. No. Oh, jeez. This guy must really like me. Don't hit the laser. Don't like the laser. I don't know. It's just like, it's so... It's making me feel... Don't laser me. This makes me feel terrified. Like, the particular style of things. No, please. No, please. No, please. Oh, God. I, I keep zooming in on the thing. Oh, my God. I keep zooming in and I don't want to zoom in on it. At least it's forgiving about the boss fights. I guess the different phases don't really repeat themselves. Oh, I don't know if I'm going to be able to... Oh, no. Oh, no. Run to the side. You're fine. You're okay. Just keep on running. Just fine. Just run away from the tendrils. I do not like the tendrils. No, 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 no. There we go. Nope. More tendrils. Uh, just keep on running. Keep on running around. You can't... T oh, my God. You can't touch me if I just keep running. If I just keep running, you cannot hurt me. If I, I in the house of God am protected from the demons, may the power of Christ compel thee. Do you believe in Christ? What if you don't believe in it? Does it compel me anymore to not be harmed? Stop, no, ah, oh, be trapped, Jesus Christ. No one can help me now, except for myself and the brush. I have the power of the wielder. Stop, no, or it's getting smaller. I just noticed the face is getting smaller. So if I just, oh, I'm beating it into submission. I'm bringing light back to the world. I'm gonna make it small. I'm gonna make it very tiny. Calm down. Calm down. It's it's okay now. Just calm down. Oh. No. Oh. Alrighty then. Chapter 3, Ports of Ch Chicory. I... I like that. I like that very much. I think, I think that's, I think I need to go consider some life choices. That made me think about things. I'm like terrified by the imagery there of the, oh my God. I, every so often I'm interested by the morbid and the grotesque, but when it like pops out at you like that, 
I don't know. I don't think I was I don't think I was prepared for that. It's time to recover. It's time to recover by going to sleep. Not sleep. Maybe just maybe watching something maybe like maybe uh maybe I'll recover by watching a TV show. I don't know. This was pleasant, but I think I'm gonna call for there for the evening. Save and quit. Well, this was most certainly not what I had expected this game to be. So, alrighty then. I can create gifts. Wait, what? Hold on a second. What is this? Create gif. What does that mean? I can. Whoa. Okay. What just happened? Oh, I can create a gif of. Oh, I can just save it to my computer. Well, that's cool. Yeah, I, I guess I'll save that. Cool. I don't know what that did. Reset. Get. Oh, reset and clear your store time lapse here. Oh, I can do a time lapse of painting something. Oh, that's actually really cool. All right. Well, thanks everybody for hanging around. That's where I'm. That's where I'm calling it for the evening. This was a blast. This was an absolute blast. And so, that's where we're ended, everybody. Thank you for coming along. I very much enjoyed it. Let's see if there's anybody that I can send the love to right now. We're passing the love to somebody else. Who else is playing the chicory right now? Who's playing the chicories? I see a raccoon. Oh, <gasps> sushi! Somebody named Sushi something is on. And that's that's one of my favorite foods, so that's what I'm gonna go with. And it looks like a speedrunning attempt. And they were just where I went, it seems like. What a perfect opportunity. To everybody going along with that, I hope we all enjoy it. To everybody else though, I have you uh, I hope you have a wonderful rest of your day, evening, whatever time zone that you are in. The party must continue. So so long to everybody. Goodbye.